Well, hello, everybody. Hi. How are you? Hope you're well. Wow. This stream is all over the place with the music, huh? Can you guys hear all the music, or is it just me that hears the music? I think it's just me who hears the music. Hi, everybody. Good morning. How are you? One of my lights isn't working. My music is malfunctioning. There are cats and dogs living together. Complete anarchy. But what we do have is the Clash Royale League Top 32 for this month. And, oh, boy, it's going to be a spicy one. I'm pretty excited for it. I hope you're excited for it as well. Um, we are live on both the YouTube and the Twitch. So wherever you want to watch it, go ahead and watch it there. But I think those of you who are going to be coming from inside the app will be coming from the uh, to the YouTube. To those YouTubes. So we should be jumping into some action here in just a moment. And I believe we probably do have our first game. Let's go ahead and get it up on screen. We are double screening here. In just one second, as soon as my uh, screens do work, we are double screen. Let's go ahead and get Air Surfer going up on one of our screens. Up against LCOP, and we'll go to the other side and hope that my... This should be charging. I don't know why it's not charging. Why is it not charging? Well, my other one should be working as well. Hmm. We're supposed to have two screens going, guys. Give me a moment here to get my second screen operating appropriately. As we should have... Le double screen. Oh, and it died. You know what? We're going to go totally outside the box here, guys. And uh, uno momento, por favor. Please enjoy LCOP versus Air Surfer. Absolute silliness. All right, we are back, and yes, we're going to have sound for one of the two games, the game that is not on screen right now, so give me just one moment, guys. My iPad, my second spectator died, but what we're going to do is we are going to, oh, this is going to be annoying because Mrs. Slayton's text, she is on my do not disturb list, meaning that she can text in whenever she wants, so hopefully my wife does not text me anything embarrassing while we are, while we are uh, spectating games. Because, ooh, wait a second. Hold on. Hold on, folks. Hold on, folks. We might be having a real special guest. Give me a second here to see if I can get this thing sorted out. We might be having a real special guest here. Let me go ahead and... Oh, that's going to kick me off of that one because it's the same account. My lord, folks. Well, at least we have Nova LCOP. Versus Air Surfer on one of our screens. We're going to be doing the uh, the double. We're going to be doing the double screens, which I'm very excited for. Uh, my light's not working. It has just been a morning. Guys, I got my second vaccine last night, and I had planned to like do all my setup last night. And then the second vaccine, uh, it just hit me in the face real hard. And I went to sleep at like 8 o'clock last night. And then I just woke up uh, half an hour before we're supposed to be here. So I've been trying to make everything work as quickly as I can. But um, vaccines will get vaccines will get you. But now I'm going to be all nice and locked down. Very excited for it. Ooh, Jupiter King. Let's go ahead and jump in and see some Jupiter King, who is up against Moogie. Whoa! Let's go. All right, we'll have all the information up on screen here fairly soon. But Jupiter King versus Moogie. That's kind of like the whole reason why you watch competitive Clash Royale, right? Is for matchups like that one. Um, I need to give my iPad another minute here to charge. Let's see if I can... Oh, no, that's going to kick me off of there. No, 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 no. That's going to be annoying. All right. Um, we're just have to wait for the double screening, guys, because my uh, my second device is not charged because it died because I was not responsible with it. So um, we're gonna give it a give it a minute to get it up to like at least five percent or so, and then we will kick in and uh, and get the watch. And LC Op is broken, says Georgie in the YouTube chat. Yeah, I agree with you. Um, he's been so good for so long; it's kind of crazy. Man, this lineup is gonna be really good. This lineup's gonna be really, really good. Um, Jupiter running, oh, they're both running Electro Giant. No E-Barbs, though, which I'm pretty sure we're all really excited about. Now, hold on, we will have sound here. Just trying to get my second spectating device just enough juice for it to work. And as soon as this game is over, I'll bring my phone in 
and hope that I don't get any embarrassing text messages during the, uh, you know, maybe I can turn off notifications. How do you do that? So that no, so I get no notifications for text messages because I do not want you guys, you know, my mom being like, Hey, what's going on? And then, um, you guys are all like, Oh, oh." um, let's see. Let me go ahead and go to my notifications. Man, is, is it just weird with um, no sound on whatsoever? There we go, notifications. And we're going to go to my, my texting app. We're going to turn them off. Watch Mrs. Slayton text me something. Allow notifications. Um, we do not want any on the, let's see. Um, no banners. Oh, wait, hold on. Uh, no banners. No lock screen. Let's just turn off notifications entirely for this. Oh, cool. So, all right, here we go. Let's get my, we'll get my phone plugged in. We'll have two screens, at least for the moment, while we are waiting for the uh, second dev- the, the proper second device to charge up. Here we go, two seconds, and Moogie holds on here. All right, let's now go ahead and get two proper screens. Here we go, two proper screens, and I'm going to switch this one to... Oh, let me go ahead and actually cut that screen for a second, guys. So you can't see it. There we go. And let me go ahead and switch to a different account. Let's go here. Let's go here. Let's go to this account. Okay, great. Now we're going to be double screening it. And as soon as we get my other iPad up and running, then we'll be like super double screening it. Um, but for now, we'll do it this way. Let me go into the Discord. And I'll, ch- I'll get I'll get me trying to the chat here in just a minute, too. I'll be like, hey, chat, what's up? Um, but for now, just trying to get all the ducks in a row. Again, I was all ready to get everything ready to go last night and then fell asleep real early. Thanks, vaccines. Um, let's go ahead and check out game number two of Air Surfer and Elsiop. And then I will go right over here and use the... Here, we, now we can go back and jump onto this one right here. And we are in round one. And let's see, what's going to be a good one over here? I mean, you got to watch Jupiter and Moogie, right? Like, oh, Anaban and JP, Anaban's up on that one. Yeah, Air Surfer and El Sop, we're current watching. Morton and Cooper. We'll definitely be watching some Morton today, don't you worry, folks. Don't you worry, folks, since we're double screening in particular, we will definitely be watching some Morton on this one, too. All right. I think we're in okay shape here. I'm going to get my iPad to charge up correctly. And then we will sit here and wait for game number two of... uh, of that one. Let me go ahead and take a look at the chat here for a moment, see how you guys are doing. Let's see, on Twitch, uh, I'll pop out your chat so I can see you guys. Sorry to ignore all of you for so long. Hope you're doing well on this beautiful Sunday morning. I know I certainly am. And let's see, we'll get all the chats going so I can see all the wonderful things that you guys have to say, all the important opinions and thoughts. And then we'll go ahead and get this match going here in a moment. LCOP running pretty traditional graveyard. And Air Surfer's been running this deck a lot. I wonder if, if anybody prepared for this one, because Air Surfer's been running this minor mortar deck a whole bunch as of late. It's been one of his go-tos. Here, I'm going to reload this. Let's see if we can get... I kind of I think this is the match we want to bring on, right? We don't really, we don't really care about other matches at the moment. Um, once we're going to be dedicated to Morton gameplay, it says Leaden. Yeah, maybe, should be. Um, oh yeah, Sam, that's right. Hold on. Let me go look at my... Oh, excellent. Um, bu- 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 bum. Hold on, folks. Hold on, folks. We're going to have um, a very, very, very special guest on, uh, uh, on the stream today. I, this is, is going to be a rare treat here. Um... Gonna be a rare treat indeed. Let me go ahead and I need to add as well as I have to add an audio source. Um hmm. To get this very special guest on. Uh yes, add that one. And we're gonna add a very special audio source here. Alright. We'll be getting that one ready to go. Ooh, that's gonna be fun. People ask who, who should be my co-caster today. We need quadruple screen, says Nauer. Yeah, I agree with you. There's not enough gameplay happening here. 
I'm trying to go ahead and get this, uh, get game two of Moogie and Jupiter King up, but for some reason it's just not showing. Unless I'm not logged into Battlefy on this on this device, and that's the problem. Oh yes. All right, hold on, guys. Let me close this one because I'm not logged into Battlefy on this device. Hey, <laughs> hey. Let me see if my iPads charged up enough. No, it is not. All right, hold on. I just realized that the whole problem might have been that I wasn't logged in appropriately on my phone. But now I'm going to be logged in appropriately, and we're going to be great. I was like, why is this game not starting? It's taking so long to start. And boom, here we go. Let's go. All right. I mean, what else could you want right here, right? You have Nova, you have Elsia versus Air Surfer on one screen. You have Jupiter King versus Moogie on the other screen. This gameplay is really freaking loud. Let's take that gameplay way the heck down. And we are waiting on our special guest here. Uh, so please hold. Let's see if he added me as a friend. Special guest. I think you're in the chat, special guest. All right, Air Surfer takes game number two. And because I friends listed the heck out of this one, we can just pop from game to game here. In fact, you know what? We're going to go ahead and uh, watch. We'll leave Jupiter on that. Let's go bring up IMJP on the other one. Boom. So JP and Anaban on the right-hand side of your screen. Jupiter King and Moogie on the left-hand side. Jupiter running Hog EQ cycle. And you see why Air Surfer's loving that one deck. Hey, there we go. There we go. Um, let me go ahead and find you. Um, added me. Hold on. Pending. I don't see. Oh, there we go. Boom. Oh, this is going to be fun, guys. I'm very excited for this. This is a great. This is a. A great get for the channel, let me tell you. Um, let me see if I can, if, if the sound is working here, but I'm going to go ahead and... Um, oh, this is going to be fun, guys. I'm going to go see if I can get him, get him added in here. And then we'll all be here together. It'll be so fun. Let me do this. To the, let me go throw out the multi-output device. Oh, hold on. Let me go ahead and turn on the computer audio. Can you try that one more time? Oh, weird. Hold on. It's not picking you up. Give me a second here. Oh, man. Come on. Come on, computer. Don't do this to me. Let me let me figure out. Oh, man. This is going to be... Um, oh, that's, that should be there. No, you've... Let's see. You should be able to hear me here. And for some reason... Let me try something really quickly. And just see something... No, nope, that, okay, so that is picking up. Um, hmm, it is not liking this audio. Let me go ahead and get another game going here, and then you and I will continue to try to figure out what the best solution is for this particular issue. Um, all right, we are waiting for game number three on um, Moogie versus uh, Jupiter King, everyone. Um, and, of course, JP and Anaban going on the right-hand side, and my iPad now, at, my other iPad now at 4% charging, so we will have that up and running here in a moment. And man, he had such a great. He came in with such so much energy too. Um, are you on Skype as well, by any chance, or just on Discord? Ah, no. Okay. Yeah, Discord's been Discord's been glitchy lately. Oh, you can hear. Wait, you can hear my. You guys can hear my guest. You guys can hear my guest. For real talk. Um, hold on. Yeah, guys, I will balance the game with when I can, but unfortunately, I'm on a phone and an iPad, so I can't balance the game with yet, but I will. Um, you guys say, people in the chat say they can, he oh, no, Twitch says they can't hear him. Yeah, no, oh, no, someone's just, someone's just joking. Someone's just lying in the, in the, in the YouTube chat. Hmm, why is this not? Let me try to sort this one out as we wait for our next game here. Streamer mode is enabled, and we'll go to my voice and video. And the let's do the output device as this. Um, try saying hi again. Ah, yeah. See, this is this is the problem I was having with Discord before. Discord is real glitchy when it comes to streaming these get these these days, guys. Unfortunately, let's go ahead and get our next game going. Um, darn. Let's go ahead and jump Air Surfer, Air Surfer, and LC Op game number three back up as we were waiting for our Moogie 
versus Jupiter King game three to get going. Um, let's see. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out how to get our how to get our guest in here and get it working because I can hear him, but for some reason the computer does not want to hear him right now. Hmm. 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 What is, a, what is another option? Do you have TeamSpeak? Nope. Arr. Can you download Skype? Well, there we go. All right. Well, we'll have to. We'll have to just. Um. We'll have to put you on the back burner for a couple of minutes. Let me know how it's going, and um, once we have you loaded up, we'll get you in, and it'll be a whole lot of fun because I think I think everyone will be really excited to have you as a co-caster for sure. I know I am. Um, I don't want to like I don't I don't want to give it away until you're on. So, um, I'll give it away like as soon as we actually get you on here, and we're waiting on that next game. Hey guys, if you want the screens to be the same size, the iPad is at four percent charge. So we're getting there. We're getting close. But right now we're gonna be uh, on both sides. Um, we're gonna be on a phone on one side and a iPad on the other side, and we are waiting for game number three here of Moogie and Jupiter King. That's why I'm double screening this, guys, is so that we didn't... Oh, here we go. Game number three in. Let's get it. Let's get it going. All right. So Jupiter King and Mugi. Mugi, the, one of the top players in the world out of Japan. Jupiter King, his counterpart in South Korea, whose profile is not as high as Mugi's profile these days. Uh, although Mugi has not been quite Mugi as of late either. But I did make a video last week picking five players who've never made a top eight monthly final, who I think will be in Worlds, and Mugi's on that list. So, you know, I, I do think that Mugi will make World Finals this year. And as soon as we can get my co-caster in here and we get all this audio stuff sorted out, uh, I'll get his opinion on some of these picks as well. But uh, right now he's working on getting a... Um, uh, don't worry, guys, the Sunnies are coming. Don't you worry. Um, right now he's working on getting some um, uh, his, tech, his tech stuff set up because Discord doesn't like me for some reason. On the other side of it, uh, the multiple time CRL China, CRL Asia, and of course CRL World Final Champion, LC up, up against Air Surfer. And I thought LC up and Air Surfer, oh no, it was, it was Jupiter and Mugi who already both ran the giant both, right? Right, am I right, am I wrong? Am I confused? Am I confused? I'm pretty confused. Guys, if you haven't yet, don't forget to subscribe to my channel because um, that's what cool kids do. If you don't subscribe to my, can my channel, not cool. That's basically what it comes down to. Final 90 seconds on the right-hand side of your screen between LC Op and Air Surfer. 578 left. Electro Giant. Man, that zap from a distance. That's going to be a GG well played. Air Surfer takes the game over LC Op. So now we'll go back over to our left-hand side of the screen where it is Jupiter King running this. It looks like the same, very similar minor deck to what Air Surfer was running up against. And guys, <laughs> Mega Knight, Mother Witch, E-Barbs in CRL with tons of money on the line. That's, that's the universe we live in right now. And another game on the right-hand side as we are still going through this. Yusuf and Ali. And, oh, we're getting right into that one out of the gate with Ali opening Golem behind King Tower. Wow. You make it to the top 32 in CRL. You have a chance at making the, the monthly broadcast, and you do Golem behind King Tower to open the game. There you go. Um, that is not the correct bracket over there on Twitch, those of you on Twitch trying to find it. Um, I guess I'll, I'll let me grab you the, the bracket link, which is real long, Twitchers. My normal little um, my normal stream deck thing is not plugged in because I have, I have to have too many things plugged in. To, um, to have double screens, so I can't press all my buttons that give you the brackets, unfortunately. Let's see. Yeah, goal in first place, go, go, brr. Um, so I think these are the last two games of this round. And so far, Jupiter and Mookie pretty evenly matched up. Yeah, goal in first play, top 32 in CRL. That one hurt me. That one hurt me emotionally. But what I liked about that one was that Yusuf said, you're going to do that? Well, I'm just going to punish you with a whole lot in the opposite lane because don't do that. Don't do that. That's my feeling about it. Don't do it. But he did it, and he got punished for it, and Yusuf agreed with me with that strong punishment. And right now, talking about punishment, Mugi putting some hurt on the right-hand side. Mega Knight will not get the King Tower activation. 
That King Tower activation works fine. You throw the, you know, the, the attractor in the middle and then something like spears or skeletons right in front of King Tower and it goes boom, boom. But if that Mega Knight's too chopped down like you saw there, not going to get it done. Here we go. E-Barbs picking up the Miner. And Jupiter's just up against a lot of pain here. Right? There's no... He doesn't have any of the DPS needed to... Like, he's not going to be able to do enough damage fast enough against this deck, in my humble opinion. Ooh, okay. All right, so... Excellent. Guys, I'm getting information from our, our co-caster here. Um... All right, I'm going to end the voice call, co-caster, and I'm going to send you my Skype information. Killer. Oh, this will be fun, guys. I'm excited. Uh, there's, there's, some, there's some technical difficulties today. We're acknowledging it, but let me tell you something. Um, it's going to be worth it once we get this new co-caster in here because he's going to be super fun. Um, special, special guest, if you will. Let me go ahead and uh, do this. Um, uh, let me just do this. And once this works, we'll be in great shape. All right, I don't think anyone's actively playing in this round. Yeah, that's the end of this round. So let's go ahead and take a look at the current standing situation. And I am trying to get our co-caster up in up in this um let's see where are you at co-caster um so let's go take a look at the the current situation as it stands we'll go into the standings and um you know what <clears throat> i bet you our co-caster can help me navigate some of these non-english names because I know that in Group B in second place, that's Moogie, who just beat Jupiter King, but I don't know who that is in first. Um, let's see. There, it looks like there's an issue in Group C of some sort. And Cooper beat Morton. Interesting to know. Oh, Yusuf is still going. All right, let's go ahead and bring that one up. Yusuf and Ali still going on that side of the screen. Um, Sandbox. I need, ah, I need to get, I need to get all the, uh, the, the names down. Notifications. Oh. I have to update. Darn it. Skype! It'll work. It'll work, guys. My face glam is glitchy. Yeah, I have so many things open and running that my computer's a little bit frustrated with me. It's a little annoyed with me, guys. But uh, hopefully it'll it'll work. But I have so many things happening at once right now. I'm hyping up the guest. I'm, just, I'm excited for the guest, guys. You guys, I mean, I think you guys, will, you guys will like my guest. If you guys don't like my guest, I think something's wrong with you, actually. I think it means that you're a bad person, probably. Uh, that's just my guess. So, still waiting on our next on our next round to start here, which is good. We have a nice little break here as we as we go ahead and get. Um, uh, we go ahead and get this guy on here. Discord has been has been disappointing. Disappointing Gord is what we should call it from now on. Was that too? Was that too cheese? Have to be sometimes. Um, this is very quiet. Let me go ahead and put some music on while we're doing this. Hopefully, there's some. Let me go ahead and make sure that I can hear it. Oh no, I can't. Hear, why can you hear it? Man, my computer is. Oh, there we go. There's some music. All right. All right. All right. Let's get it. Let's go. Go back. Let's get this audio call going. Oh, hello, hello. Hello, hello. Are we Perfect. on? Perfect. Hey, guys. Um, you know what? This actually even calls for some sunnies because of how good this this guest is. Let's go ahead and throw on the Waka Waka Wakas. Guys, on the line right now, longtime Clash Royale League player, uh, one of your favorites. Out of Germany, the mad scientist himself, OP Sam on the line. What's up, dude? I'm so happy 
that you hit me up, man. I'm happy to be here. Uh, I, I'm sure you're pretty excited that, uh, your, your close friend is, um, is making a pretty strong move, obviously. Uh, we're not going to bring it up too much, but you, you got very close this month. Um, you know, I, we, I keep on expecting, we're definitely going to see you in, in one of these top 32s, if not a top eight, one of these days, um, fairly soon. But, uh, it, it's got to feel good though to, to see Morton up here, uh, repping the squad. Yeah. I feel the same way with Air Surfer. I'm good friends with him as well. Speaking of Air Surfer, um, let's see who he's up against right now. Um, oh, he's up against another one of your countrymen. Um, man, how do you pick? How do you pick someone to root for in this one? You have uh, your 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 countryman Schwarzen uh, up against your longtime friend and former teammate at TSM Air Surfer. Definitely rooting for Jack. <laughs> <laughs> I, I like Jack Schwarzen. Schwarzen is definitely a nice guy, but I'm friends with Jack. Fair enough. Um, so trying to figure out what another yeah. good, a good alternate game is. Ooh, we have Rad versus Mugi, a battle of the of the Japanese players. And of course, let's see who else do we have on here. Oh, Morton and Awesome. Let's go ahead and throw Morton's game up here as well. What's that lightning? Did you what just see that? that lightning? Oh yeah, you talking about you're watching the Air Surfer Schwarzen game? Yes. You lightning the tower with nothing else. Well, sometimes you have to just lightning that tower, dude. Um, <laughs> You know, you're kind of like, hey, there's a tower there, and I have a lightning. And what else would I, um, what else would I do other than just hit it with that? So, you know, like I understand the emotion. Um, hold on, guys, we're gonna be getting the the other game up here in a moment. Just letting the, let's see, this match invite is pending. Okay, let me go ahead and reload this page here. So I guess that lightning in the tower by itself wasn't a great idea. Yeah. I'm actually kind of surprised how popular Egine is in these tournaments. Like everybody's playing Egine. Yeah, it's interesting. Why is it just you think it's because it doesn't conflict? And I'm going to the um, Samuel Basoto Rafael Mendez um, or Menez, uh, Menezes. I thought it was Mendez. Rafael Menezes. I'm going to his game. Um, and let me go ahead. Oh, here we go. And now we also have Morton up. Let's go. I have a feeling. I actually don't know his process for this sort of thing. Is he pretty independent when it comes to events like this? Or are you guys as a team kind of working with him, analysis, stuff like that? No, he's pretty independent. He just chooses his own decks, chooses everything himself. He doesn't have an analyst whatsoever. Pretty wild. Yeah, I mean, is that like how you guys worked during the during like the normal CRL, or was he like, or was it? I mean, pretty much. I mean, we helped each other choose decks, for example. But most of the time, it comes like to your own decision what you want to play. I mean, if he says he wants to play that, I'm not gonna say play this. Like, it's his choice. Sure. Um, let's see. Let's go ahead and find, um, oh, Belly just ended his game. Let's see. Uh, I'm trying to remember who this one, who this is. Um, okay, so this is some of the help I would love to have from you is um, uh, being able to navigate some of these names that I don't know, right? Like musical note, a bunch of characters. Uh, I note. actually don't know who these people are as well. I'm really terrible with Asian names. Man, that's the whole reason I had you on here. Because I <laughs> was like, I have to put up with Sam. But uh, if he gives me these Asian names, then I'll be able to get it. But, um, you know, so I know some of them. I know that actually the guy at the bottom here is, uh, I think, German, actually. Um, the guy with the with the with with these characters here at the very bottom. Um, I think he's one of the German players, in fact. Um, and then we'll figure it out. We'll figure everybody out here. Oh, let's know. Let's go ahead and throw JP up on the on the other side of the screen. Let me kill this music too. So we don't need the music. Now we have the gameplay going. All right. So Morton and Awesome. Um, do you know anything about Awesome? Awesome. He loves Witch Bam and MK a lot. I mean, it says it in his name, MK. Sure. <laughs> he uses the MK E barbs uh, Royal Hawk stack really often. So that's actually a fun question for you. Um, obviously, you got you and uh, Morton and the Germans overall, but you and Morton, they almost made it a meme that the Germans love piggies. Um, and then the Royal Hogs, even though they're kind of, they're semi, they're like second tier meta right now, I feel like I don't see you guys using them very much. Mm, I think they're actually pretty good right now, not gonna lie. The Hogs are quite strong, it's just matchup dependent. You can have very, 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 very good matchups, but you can also have terrible matchups with them. All right, let me go ahead and adjust my phone, guys. I'm gonna switch. Well, I'm gonna switch the phone out for the iPad here in a minute, which is why I didn't want to adjust it because um, I didn't have to adjust it back for the other one. But um, yeah, I will zoom the left screen once I get it switched into the other device, guys. 
This is my first time double screen in a long time with actual devices. So uh, please bear with me on some of the technical challenges that we get into. Um, so we talked about, I mean, we already saw one uh, ridiculous, we, we, obviously E-Barbs are now in um, competitive meta, but now we're seeing Morden up against G Goblin Giant Sparky. Is it, at least it's not the Rage version, or uh, <laughs> is this also pretty cheese? It's pretty cheese, but yeah, Rage version would probably, actually, no, I think this version is even worse for Morton because he has EQ against the Tesla. Like, geez, there's nothing much Morton can do right now. His defense is good against Sparky, but the only way he can do damage is with Miners, but every time he's going to play a Miner, MK is just going to ignore it. Yeah, people are playing this Miner, and this is Miner to Red Lotus over on the oh, Twitch whoa, side. Oh, whoa, it's actually grave, yeah. Oh, wow. Well, that's a whole lot better. Yeah, that's making a big difference. So here we go, final minute of Morton and Awesome. That's a lot of damage. Yeah, quite a bit. 1389 on that bottom left-hand tower to the 979. And I am This is definitely winnable, right definitely, definitely winnable for Morton. Good skeletons, great skeletons. Yeah, a good reset there at the bridge. I mean, what's the key for him in these final 40 seconds? He has to cycle one or two more graveyards. He's probably only get one more. He has to hope for a good graveyard NG to get a lot of damage. Well, let's see if he can get it. Final 27 oh seconds. My. That sparky shot hurt. But Graveyard in. Poisoning as well. Muskie getting hurt like crazy. 822. The EQ cycle is going to take the lead back here for Awesome in the last couple of seconds. But Awesome has to actually get on tower here and cycle another EQ and zap. Whereas Graveyard can throw some skeletons right on there. Skellies get in. Poison getting down as well. 631. Going to be under 600 HP. That EQ's ticking away. What? Oh, oh no. 548 to 409. And Awesome MK takes it with the EQ cycle. It's unfortunate. I feel it. I feel it. All right, let me go ahead. I'm going to switch out my phone, I think, for this iPad now. It's... I think it's charged enough. It's charged a little bit here. And also, then Mrs. Slayton will not be upset with me for ignoring all of her texts. Uh, and I'm sorry for, like, being a little bit biased, but these guys are my friends, so I hope you understand. Yeah, guys, um, I'm going to try to be as unbiased as possible here, but um, Sam, yeah, I'm going to go... I'm going to say be as biased as you want because you're not an officially uh, hired CRL caster. You're a pro player who I'm inviting on to hang out and have a good time. So if you... Perfect. You know, I mean... Don't call anyone anything rude, but other than that, uh, enjoy yourself. Do you have the, the the list, like the actual standings right now? Yes, I'm about to bring them up in just a moment here. Let me actually go ahead and kill this screen for a second. Um, I don't like to show you guys the behind the scenes stuff, guys. I, I don't even I don't show I don't show chat. You know, I, I keep it all I keep it all above board here. But let's go ahead and jump in to the uh, battle fi. And I will get this thing up here for you in just a moment. I think I'm logged in on Battlefy. Let's see. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at the, the bracket information here in the first round. As Anaban and Bob the Rock, Karel de Grot, go on the other side <laughs> of things. Um, and let's go ahead and take a look at the standings as they are so far. Um, I guess they haven't updated the game standings yet. Oh, Sandbox is now 2-0 and in Group D. So that's good to know. Sandbox in a good spot. Samuel Basoto, uh, Rafael Mendez has or Menez, Menezes has dropped down to 0-2. Samuel Basoto currently top of that group. Other than that, nothing too fancy happening here. Let's go ahead and jump back into the gameplay. Um, let's see. You know, I will say this, uh, Sam. You were there for one of my one of my greatest victories of all time. Do you remember what I'm talking about? One of my one of my all time best Clash Royale victories in my life. Don't remember, honestly. Uh, it's when I had you and the guys from TSM over for dinner at my place. Ah, and yeah, I remember that. And I beat Vulcan. I think he played like I think I I can't remember what we played, but it was definitely my matchup, no questions asked, like by a lot. But uh, I did I did take a best of one off of Vulcan, and it will be my all forever will be my uh, my uh, my go to achievement in Clash Royale. Let's go. Because I'm never qualifying for CRL. Put it let's put it that way, folks. All right, we're about to get we're, we're waiting here to get Morton and Awesome game number two up in a, mo in a moment. There's the decks they had in game number one. Um, <clears throat> so I don't know, if, Sam, if you saw, I made a I made a list of five players, and uh, now that you're on, it's almost embarrassing I didn't put you on the list. Um, but five <laughs> players who hadn't made a top eight yet, who uh, who I think have a good chance of qualifying for Worlds, 
Yeah. And um, I, I that list was um, Moogie, Anaban. Um, I mean, Moogie and Anaban both made it now into the top 16. Uh, I mean, 32. Top, they made top 32, yeah. But yeah. I'm talking about that top eight, that broadcast stuff. Okay. Um, yeah, Anaban for sure, like his ladder finishes are always good. He's very consistent in the ladder. He's kind of getting to world finals pretty sure. Yeah. Just by just by ladder. On ladder. Yeah. Yeah, the way he's doing ladder this season is so crazy. Um, let's see. Val gonna swing once, Val gonna swing twice. Anaban in trouble here against Bob the Rock and goes minor to the exact same spot here. And you see the Dark Prince tries to predict on the outside, and this is just some spell cycle, and that should be pretty easy there for Bob the Rock. So I guess this is why people are playing this. Oh, this is Mortar GY again. No, no, it's Mortar Minor because the Miner is glitched out. So I guess why people are playing this Mortar Minor deck is because it matches up well against the E Giant and people are playing lots of E Giant. Yeah, Mortar is great against E Giant. Mortar is super good against E Giant just because you can pressure so much. And Musketeer, like you don't always have that elixir to lightning the Musketeer. The Musketeer is going to kill everything. Mortar against E Giant is one of the greatest matchups you can have. Okay, so that says that they're back into a game, but for some reason... I'm trying to get them up on this one, guys, because this one has sound, but for some reason that one's not working, so let's go ahead and get Morton and Awesome up on that screen instead, and Battlefy... Uh, you know what? Get out of here, Battlefy. All right, so we'll have a, a no-sound game, unfortunately, guys, for Morton and Awesome. Um, Battlefy was glitching out and not telling me they were fighting, unfortunately. But I'm going to bring up on the other screen if, it, if it's working. Oh, am I not logged in again? I'm not logged in again. Because I switched devices. Hold on, folks. I know, I know, I know, Sam. Um, I was not logged in on this. I switched devices, guys. It happens. Not exactly sure who has the match up here. Yeah, but Morton has the advantage pretty nicely, though, with how bad that King yeah. Tower is chunked down. I mean, he oh has... God, the lava pops are doing so much damage. I mean, having Skarmy and Ebarbs both to control on the ground. I mean, he has to get that are good. Let's get the Skarmy down for that Prince, and there he goes. I think if MK gets one big E Giant push and Lightning's both drags, he instantly wins. Are Bob the Rock and Carl the Great the same person? Asked Burton B. Yes, they are. Who am I talking to, guys? I should put his name up on screen here. I'm gonna go ahead and actually, I'm gonna go ahead and do that in a minute here. Um, but uh, I, that is OP Sam, longtime CRL Pro SK Gaming two v two partner of Morton, the Mad Scientist himself. Which you know we haven't you and I haven't really talked about this before, Sam. Um, you know I I gave out lots of nicknames in that first season of CRL, <laughs> and yours is just yeah. the one that like beyond any other nickname, <clears throat> yours is the one that stuck stuck like SK Gaming totally like embraced it. I mean, do you like it? Do you dislike it? Is it funny? No, I like it. It's cool. I like it. It's uh, it's it's that tickles me every time that I see like someone else use it and actually use it in earnest. Yeah, SK is like having, like, they've made a lot of tweets <laughs> saying I'm a mad scientist. I don't mind. I like it. Well, I would say, have you ever seen the movie Back to the Future? What? Have you ever seen the movie Back to the Future? Back to the Future? Isn't that pretty old? It's a, yeah, it's a movie from the 80s. <laughs> yeah, I've seen it's, it. I've seen it. Seen it. <laughs> hey, Morton gets a three crown there. Um, if they made a movie about a young Doc Brown, I think that you would be perfectly cast as the young Doc Brown. The, the scientist who makes the time machine. Actually, my hair is like super long now and would fit. There we like go. I can make it go up and it looks crazy. I, Hollywood, get in on this. I have your guy. I have your guy. Or a Von, maybe maybe you have to be um, Werner Von Braun to just just for the accent. Who knows? Um, what's the score between Morton and uh, it's all, Austin now? All tied one up, or? one and one. Okay. I'm going to throw, um, let's see, let's see who Jupiter's up against here. Against Faust. Against another one of your countrymen as well. Yep. Um, I'm going to throw a little thing on screen here. I'm trying to get this game. Um, I'm now, I know I'm logged into Battlefy now, guys. There we go. Let's get this, let's get this game going on screen. And let me know when Morton's back in game, and I'll switch over to his game here. Okay. You can do that. Oh, thank you. Now here's a here's a question that might be I don't know if I'm putting you in a tough spot here. Um, why are you not? Sh why is the oh? Because the screen still turned off. That's right. Um, here's a tough question for you. Which which team house was more fun, the TSM team <laughs> house um, or the SK Gaming team house? Uh, TSM. 
Yeah. <laughs> we had a lot of fun in uh, SK, but not as fun as in TSM. Yeah, TSM. But we uh, didn't have a house with SK. We had apartments, so it was kind of different. Like you weren't living. You guys had separate apartments. Yeah. Like even Me when you guys were... were sharing one, Sergio and Javi were sharing one, and our coach had his own. And this this is when you guys were here in the states. Yeah. Oh, interesting. I didn't know that. I was unaware of that fact. How? What is Air Surfer's record so far, guys? We'll get that up in a little bit. Um. So, let me know. Are we back? Are is Morton? Morton and yeah, he's back in game. He's, he's back, back in game. game. All right. Let's go ahead. We're gonna we're gonna ditch out on Jupiter King and Faust. Sorry, Jupiter King Faust fans. Um. But we're gonna go ahead and get Morton and Awesome. I messaged Morton to put him on my friends list this morning for this event, and he didn't get back to me in time. Very sad. <laughs> I mean, at least you can watch from Awesome's perspective. Yes, exactly. I'm. You it's know so what? Awesome I'd rather have Awesome like my friends list anyway. So, whatever. I see. So, okay, this is an interesting, a good question for you since we have you on the line here. Um. <laughs> You know, we talked about it on stream a bit and also talked about it off stream between myself and Andrew and, uh, and AC and Eric. We were really shocked by Morton running log bait last month during the, uh, I think it was during the first of the two finals. Why? Um, you know, none of us really felt like, especially in that meta, that log bait was very strong. Um, but it sounds like from your why that you disagree. Uh, which which season was it? This was last month, um, during the last monthly, month. Last month's the monthly finals against Line. Um, I mean, Lockway never like Lockway is pretty solid. Uh, the, I mean, the newer Lockway creation with wall breakers was super good. Yeah, I think he was running a more traditional variation though. You mean, like standard with Inferno Tower? Yeah, you know, let me look at which one he was running. Um, because I can actually. Go to Royale API. Shout out Royale I mean, API. Lockpick has always been like it's it's not always good on ladder because oftentimes there's just too much expo. But in competitive, it really shines. Fair enough. You know, you you, you heard it here first, folks. Um, Logbait is gangster, and I was wrong. Uh, DC the boss saying dual screens is an awesome addition. Yeah, I agree. Um, let's see who's the other caster player. Oh yes, I need to let me let me add the. Oh yeah, my my face cam is really glitching out here. I have too many tabs open, guys. That's really what's going on here. I uh, Trying to run so many things at once is making my machine chug a little bit. My CPU just dropped down to 8 frames per second for, for a moment there, guys. So I, apologies as I'm trying to learn how to do um, how to dual screen here for the first time. You know, I'm going to kill Discord on my computer just to take a little bit more, uh, a little more computing power back to the machine here. Not All right, sure. Piggy's trying to get in. Is that enough? Oh, that snowball's going to do yes, it. Yes, it is. Another poison. Ooh. Oh, wow. Not quite. All right, so can he outcycle a snowball? Oh, my God. Snowball's not in cycle. Throwing literally everything. 5 HP on the tower. Throwing literally everything. Oh can my. Morton do it? Snowball. Can Morton do it? Can Morton do it? Let's go! What? Nice. 5 HP win for Morton. That's what's up. Unbelievable. <laughs> Unbelievable. What a win. What a win for Morton. Oh, man. What a win. Yeah, I think MK got a little bit too greedy with that last snowball. Yeah. Sort of just kept playing defensively. Wow. Ooh. Big wows, big wows, guys. Yeah, I am, I am, guys. I'm closing a bunch of stuff here to uh, try to get my computer to focus more on just the game pl uh, on putting all its power towards bringing you guys the best stream. Um, wow. Let's get a, a applause in the chat here, folks. Wait, why did where where what? What are you doing? All right, let's go take a look at the standings right now. Let's see who I have who's playing. Coatbridge, Paul, you are not in this event. Ooh, let's take a look at Rad right now. And let's go if back. He, if Florida would have lost right there, it would have been 0-2, wouldn't he? Would have been 0-2, yeah. Yeah, like pretty much would have been a knockout already. Yeah, would have been pretty crazy. Would have been pretty crazy. Um, now guys, I'm trying to work on the... 1 is still okay. Yeah, 101 and 1, especially, does this, um, especially because of the... Uh, have you seen a bigger send in your life, says Daniel Levy in the YouTube chat? Yeah, dude. Um, that was crazy. 
That was that was a huge send. I mean, he basically threw everything he could imagine. All right, so here we are in Group A. I don't I don't know who that is leading Group A right now. Um, I need to go and like check and like compare that to the uh, to the other stuff. Close for the content. Um, oh, what like re? Oh, what like close and open my 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 machine? Um, I don't think so. Oh, close for the content, not close. Got it. Um, so on the left hand side of the screen, we do have our standings here. Um, you can see the points are just barely in there because the way that my screen is formatted for this. Um, but uh, currently, Crisp Tarta, who won his his uh, Swiss bracket, is second behind whoever that might be. If your CPU is struggling, just download more RAM. Eh, nice. Strong move. Um, let's see. Moogie is 2-0 and in his group. So Jupiter King and Rad. This is actually huge between Jupiter King and Rad because the winner of this matchup between these two will be 2-1 and one and will take control of second place for the moment. Um, Chensi Aslan who's one of the better players out of Turkey, currently leading his group. Um, and we'll get to our next game for Morton here in just a moment. Um, oh, actually, let's go ahead and see if we can get game three now that we're looking at it. Um, here we are in round two. And let's go ahead and find Morton. And where are you, Morton? Morton and Awesome. Oh, nope. I guess, no, nope, Morton's already won two to one. So... Oh, because that one was the 2-1 win. Okay, it hasn't updated the standings yet. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Let's see. Take a look at the results. Anyone else still going? Besides our game on the right-hand side of your screen. Double screen in it, everybody. All right, let's see. We're getting ready for game for round three here. By the way, is Andrew uh, not casting? He is casting. Just this is the the um for these qualifiers. There's not. We're not like on. This isn't like our official casting. This I is know, I know. Because it's on my channel. Are you not interested in in casting this? Say what? Is he not interesting in uh, casting this like pre qualifier? He, he's done some of the qualifiers on his channel. Um, oh, I see. Yeah, yeah. But this is all this is all like just community like you know access casting or whatever. So uh, this is not my official job casting. This is me just like hey, I'm casting some of it. So he's cast some of these. I've cast some of these. Um, AC and Eric cast everything because they're streaming addicts. Um, they might have a problem. They might need to see somebody about how addicted they are to streaming. Um, but, uh, yeah, no, Andrew and I both do like, I didn't do, I don't, I don't really do the Saturdays very much cause it's too much of a grind for me. And Andrew does some of the Saturdays, but we'll be, of course, all four of us together for CRL next weekend. I mean, Saturdays, we could probably cover one group it takes around five to six hours, but if, if, for example, Big Spin is covering every group and is streaming pretty much all day long. Yeah. Big Spin's a monster though, dude. Big Spin, that guy, I think he was born like actually already with a YouTube stream key. Okay. If Rand would have a Mega Knight instead of the P.E.K.K.A. in this matchup, this would be way, 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 way better. This P.E.K.K.A. is so useless. Yeah, it's not doing too well here. P.E.K.K.A. is an interesting choice. Three princesses. Oh, my God. <laughs> That's a new card coming out. That's Guys, you guys Wait, heard it here first. Besides the poison tower. Oh, my God. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Three princesses. That's prince Princess I. Can you get a fourth one? Oh, yeah. Rip. <laughs> right, guys. Yeah, um, three princesses is gonna be is gonna be the new card coming out um, next month. You guys are hearing it hearing it here first. Uh, not confirmed. I'm just making things up. Let's see. Let's take a look at Modic is Scottish, so um, but he's not in this thing. Let's take a look at Belly um, here in his round three matchup, and let's see who. Let's go take a look at our at our next round three matchup. Um, I don't know who Jack's playing up against, and if you guys have any requests there in the chat of who you want to see. Um, let me know. You know, we're going we're gonna to be watching, obviously, a lot of Morton stuff here because we have his teammate, and it's Morton. Um, but if you have someone, someone that you guys really want to see on here, please let me know. And, yes, that is Samuel Klotz. Is that how you pronounce <laughs> it, or is it Klotz? Yes. Which one? Just Klotz. Klotz, okay. And this is uh, Air Surfer against Musical Note, something at something Musical Note, who I think is, um, oh, what is his name? Hold on. Let me go into Twitter and I'll tell you who I think it is. Um, I think that is. Oh wait, who? Which one is? Um, which one's Mikan Buya? Because I know Mikan Buya is in this tournament too. I just forget which one is his. Um... Uh, Buya is in Belgian's group, as far as I know. 
Oh, okay, yeah. I do Skeleton want to made a tweet about how he really wants to face him. Yeah, of course, because it's. I mean, if you're talking about legends of the game, um, one of the all-time, like one of my all-time favorites. First of all, like I love the Japanese scene for this game anyway. Uh, like after going to Japan for World Finals, but also just like how much fun they have. Like you can't really name a Japanese player. I don't think it's like fun to watch. But uh, Mikan Buya in particular, like he's way up there on that list. Arrows in, four. It is um, not looking too good for Jack right now. Hold on, this is Demas? No, it's, uh, it's Himawari. That's Mafia. That's who it is. It's Himawari. That's right. There you go. There we go. All right, Sandbox takes game number one. <coughs> game number one off of uh, Belly. Let's look through my, my pieces here. All right, ooh, here we go. Let's take a look at JP. That is a lot of damage for that E-Giant. E-Giant is crazy. As soon as it gets to the tower, it's just shredding it. Oh, yeah, once it gets there, it's a, it's an absolute monster. Absolute monster. Time machine not in tower range. Igor is now Hazardi. Kazardi, yeah. That's uh, someone in the YouTube chat. Noting Igor's changed name in this modern era. E-Giant, lightning, yes. GG, GG. Jack all over it. Is Jack going to beat this out? Let's go. <laughs> there we go. It's a good comeback. It was a very good comeback. No questions asked. Solid, solid comeback work there. Um, oh, let's oh, see. Wow. Let me go ahead and retweet this bad boy. Oh, wow, what? What happened? JP is actually using a deck that I have created. <laughs> well, there you go. Royal Hogs. Um, so, tell, so this is your deck. Tell me about it. Hmm. Wait, wow. Carl? No, not Carl. Uh, what's his name? Bob. Bob is using pretty much the same deck, but with Firecracker instead of Mother Witch. Yeah, I've seen Osama run this deck with Firecracker, but I was thinking Mother Witch is just fits better. But not in this matchup, I guess. Here's a good one, and shout out to the fake Lopo gang in the chat. Old school, been around for a long time. FLG, one of your all-time favorites. Finally making the top 32. I think it took him a while to get his account leveled up enough. Lopakati, a.k.a. Lopkins, up against uh, longtime Team Queso slash Arena Quesarito player in uh, Dark Angel on the bottom of your screen. Also, Morton is in the game now against uh, Cenk Aslan. Against Aslan, okay. Ooh, that's a good one. Here we go. We'll throw that one up on the, on the second screen here. The frame rate is terrible. Yeah, guys, I don't know why my frame... I think it's because I'm running... I have my face cam and two screens coming in. I'm trying to close as many things as possible to keep the frame rate from dropping, but I've never done, I have never, I have not triple screened, you know, with me and the two screens before. So that's part of the, um, the, uh, the frame rate thing, guys. But right now it's holding at 30 frames per second. Um, I think I've closed enough things to fix the issues, but, um, you know, if I will continue closing things, I'm closing more things right now, in fact, guys. More things being closed, and we're holding right now at a pretty good frame rate. I'll do my best not to have it continue to to uh, to die on us. But um, first time running this, running running the, the the stream this way. So this is that uh, mortar miner deck that basically, like you look at this deck and you go, this deck's either going to be is that also part of it too? Is that this same like seven card construction can go with either GY or miner, and there's some viability there, or is that not really an issue? Wait, wait. Can you repeat that, please? <clears throat> well, Lapo's running that um, Mortar... Oh, Lapo, okay. Yeah, he's running Mortar, Valk, and Musketeer. And there he goes, Lapo that, taking the game win. That is pretty popular. The defense is insane with that Poison, Miner, Valkyrie, Musketeer deck. Like, it's just so good. Sometimes you struggle against B-Town decks to really do damage on their tower, but the defense is so good. Uh, question in the chat, what does CHN stand for? I see a lot of players have that as their prefix. CHN is just like, I don't even know. Yeah. A, a couple of account owners basically like gave pushers accounts and they, like, they had to name it CHN in order to be able to push the account. But no one's pushing accounts now for other people in modern CRL. I mean, yeah, I'm, I'm going to say like three or four accounts in this qualifier deserve to be banned. I'm not going to name them out, but they're definitely like not legit. 
there's cheat gems and uh, account sharing and uh, a lot more going on on these CHN accounts, but <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, um, I'm going to go find us another game <laughs> right now. Uh, oh, look, Rad's playing Clash Royale. So that's fun. Let's go find another game somewhere else to watch. Um, uh, CHN is an esports org. Okay, it's an esports org, not a uh, not a um, not a thing. Got it. <laughs> Who's on call? I'll keep on meaning to put uh, meaning to put it on screen, guys. You know what? As soon as I get as soon as I get my next two games uploaded uh, up on screen, I will go ahead and um, put the next uh, put put the my co-caster's name on screen here so that you guys don't have to ask me every every moment because I don't have my button. I usually have to just press my button and go, who's on call? Boom, it's OP Sam. But my um, my stream deck isn't plugged in because I have to have room to plug in both the iPads. Um, um, CHN is Chunghua Esports. Um, let's see. There you go. Good to know. Um, let's take a look. Someone said CHN crispy hot nuggets. Sean, you know what? That's what we're going with right now. I I think that crispy hot nuggets. There you go. Um, trying to get that Lapo Dark Angel game number two up here in a moment. We'll see if we can make it happen. Oh, let me. Did I turn my notifications back on? Because is Mrs. Slayton trying to text me? No, she's not right now. Good to know. Good to know. Um, did Morton win against Awesome MK? Yes, Morton did win against Awesome MK. Linus, the bracket and all the information is in the description below. Go get it. Um, and here, come on, second game. Let's go. All right, Morton and Aslan on the right-hand side. Who do you think is the all-time best player out of Turkey? Out of Turkey? I uh, don't know. I mean, FMGG? It's pretty good, but he's not really playing anymore. Oh, Prince does oh go God, all the way. Wow. GG. Wow, I mean, no elixir. So that'll do it. 252 on the right-hand side and just play defense yeah. for a minute and Morton's got this one all locked up. Yeah, uh, I FM... I don't think Jen can come back this. It's, I don't think it's possible. Yeah, no, that's... This one's over. That's pretty, it's pretty dirty. Just defend for a minute and you're good. Here we go. It's going to be Lapo game number two here. Um, give us some air surfer. Well, yeah, now that Morton's got this one locked up, yeah. There's no way he loses this one. Let's go get some Air Surfer here, guys. Let's go throw some Jack in it. Oh, he's not playing right now, so never mind. Um, let's see. Who is playing who haven't really watched much today? Um, he haven't watched a ton of, of Samuel. So there we go. Oh, Samuel and Hire. That's a good one. All right. On your right-hand side of the screen, guys, Samuel and uh, CRL East Champion. Or CRL Asia Champion, I think. Is, uh, CRL, no, CRL China Champion is what it would have been. Hire. Um, and then on the opposite screen, of course, Lapo and Dark Angel still going. Someone tell me, is this dual mode? Yes, guys, this is dual mode. Oh, um, yeah, the frame rate seems like it's fixed it's, it's fixed now that I've killed a lot of screens. So hopefully that continues to be better. Um, I'm going to kill what some more screens this here. Deck? What is higher stack? I like it. Looks good. Looks fun um, to play. Minor Loon Rascals? Well, Minor Rascals Loon, this is kind of a throwback, because Minor Rascals Loon yeah. was a deck, like, in, what, 2019? Yeah, but it really isn't used anymore these days. Fair enough. But I've been seeing more Rascals played since the balance changes. They're they're better now. I mean, not a lot of people are using a lot. Most people are using Bot Barrel, and they're pretty good against debuffs. Um, hold on, guys. I'm going to get uh, I'm going to get something on here. What the heck? Let me go ahead and um, get this working, guys, and I will have those of you who keep asking who's the co-caster. Well, I'm going to go ahead and just put his name on screen. Um, but if you don't already follow him, you should probably do that because um, he's kind of good at Clash Royale. Um, let's see. CRL North American third place in 2018. Um, then, of course, CRL Western runner-up, CRL Western champion. Um, and, uh, oh yeah, number one finish on ladder in, I want to say it was June of 2020? Nope. it was exactly August. this month, a year ago. Oh, it was this April. month a year ago. Yeah. March of last year. That's OP Sam. And there we go. Now his name is way too big on the screen. Let me go ahead and make that a reasonable size. Whoa, 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 whoa. 
I'm going to go ahead and get this down here out of the way and then adjust it a little bit more, folks. Let me see if I can get these, like... There we go. And we'll do a little bit of drop shadow on there. And boom. Let me go ahead and get this in here at a reasonable size. I will make some adjustments to everything. Guys, this is the most pro... I don't know if you guys know this. This is the most professional um, professional stream you've ever seen. Sometimes you just got to duct tape it together, guys. That's the That's the reality. I'll make my logo smaller here to make some more room for Sam. That's how much I, that Sam, that's how much I care about you. Getting your proper Thank getting you. your props is I'm making my logo it. and putting it behind your name. Behind your name is in front of my face. Alright, there we go. All that's loaded up. Let's go ahead and get some more gameplay going here. Um Dima or Dimas is on. Did Lapo win that game? I didn't even look. Nope, he lost. Dark Angel was playing a pretty interesting deck. He was playing Giant Couple, which Mother Witch and Normal Witch, which is actually decent, which I didn't expect. Like, I've seen a lot of people run that Graveyard Freeze Witch deck recently. All right, here we go. Move my name a little bit up higher. Yeah, I mean, is it, like, do you think the meta is, like, at all settled right now, or do we still have, like, a bunch more? Oh, uh, no. I think especially in Season End, there's gonna probably be a couple of new decks. Like usually, when there's a new meta, always in season end, the meta changes. Yeah, no this this met this meta is already it's it's been nuts. Um, do you think that the Ebarb nerf uh, was enough? Do you think it? Uh, I think the Ebarb buff in the first place was not necessary, but I'm glad they at least nerfed it. But I think they should have just reverted the entire buff. Yeah, everyone has their thought. I I don't hate E Barb's being playable, but I do not want them to be everywhere. <laughs> I but you know I have a controversial opinion on on um on uh on buffs and on like the on balance changes. So I have two opinion opinions that people don't necessarily agree with. Number one is I think that um that that balance changes the goal of good of balancing should be to disrupt the meta, not balance the meta. Right, like we had a perfectly balanced I agree. meta. Yeah, I agree. Oh, cool. Like I don't like when there's the same. For example, everything is balanced. Isn't it boring? Because there's always the same meta. So I like like when they nerf or overbuff cards sometimes. Because then a new meta develops. I think yeah, I think that's critical. And it keeps the game. The only bad thing is for free to play players because sometimes they struggle uh, maxing out a new deck then. But for for me, for example, me having a full max everything, I don't like. I really like it. And someone did ask. Someone's been in the chat on the YouTube side asking a bunch um, whether I have a fully maxed account. No, I have many. I am I am flexible. I have many cards maxed, but my account, uh, now it, my my main account is the one with that with Anaban and Demas on right now. Um, I'll show you what I have maxed. Um, I have a decently maxed account. Ooh, I think Lapo's running the um, little Chen deck. That or he's running the same deck that uh, the same bait deck that we saw earlier, but I think he might be running Little Chen. No, it's just double bait. Never mind. Oh, there you go, Demas, looking like he's gonna tie things up with Anaban, and then Dark Angel uh, running the Hoggy Q. Dima probably gonna win. Says the Emoji Police. Is there any way I can like spectate the matches at the same time? Because I don't have Lapkins or Dark Angel on my friend. Oh, you list. don't have either of them added. Um, yeah. I wonder if I can get them to add you to the. Um, I do have Anaban and Demas on. Do you have either of them? Um, nope. Like I have Lapo's other account. I have Anaban's other account, but sure. I don't have these accounts. <laughs> sure. Who's Lapkins? New player? No, it's just Lapakadi's different name. Um. Well, let me let me see. I don't know if they'll let me add you. Let me let me message the uh, uh, let me message the the people and see if I can add you to the Battlefy. Um, uh, can I add my co-caster to the Battlefy? Oh, Battlefy! Man, uh, Autocorrect does not like Battlefy. 
Dark Angel, former pro in Queso. Yes, Dark Angel played, I think it was two seasons for Queso back in 2019. Um, didn't didn't quite have the run he would have liked. Did okay with, um, I yeah. believe that they paired him as a 2v2 partner with uh, with Azili's for a minute. Yeah, Azili's. They, they weren't bad. Like, Dark Angel wasn't bad. I think Kuchi did worse than him, but they decided to keep the OGs, I guess. Yeah, I mean, look, the Dark Angel was young, and certainly I think he struggled a bit with being away from home and for the first time like that. And, uh, you know, if there's one thing that I that Andrew and I both tell people a lot, it's, you know, be good at your job is number one, but also be, be easy to work with is number two. And I'm not saying that he wasn't, but it's one of those things where it's like, Hey, you know, if uh, you take a look at someone like Kuchi, who's had a lot of ups and downs in his career as a player, but, you know, you're not going to find anyone on the Team Queso side who doesn't like Kuchi Ku. And being someone that everyone likes to work with goes so far in job security, um, often much farther than being good. And not to say that anyone's bad or good or hard to work with or not or easy to work with. All right. So I think this whole round is over. Um, and I'm asking about getting you added. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> so obviously, I think, I mean, clearly you have a whole lot more. I, I don't know what the what what your day to day is now. Um, you know, obviously you're not on the same kind of grind that, like, you know, the, that like hardcore CRL. Here are the ten weeks where my whole life is just Clash Royale League. Um, it's a very different environment now. So, I mean, just curiosity for the people who are watching us, I think we're, we're ending round number three here. What are you doing with yourself now with uh, what I'm assuming is more free time compared to your previous CRL schedule? I mean, the previous schedule, we basically just like practice within the three months of CRL. We just were having a good time and practicing pretty much all day. Nowadays, I don't, I don't have to practice that much anymore. I mean, I'm still practicing. I'm streaming pretty much every day, but... There's no such thing as like, you have to practice eight hours, for example. So then what do you do with the rest of your time now that you have more free time? Um, streaming and basically just, <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm not doing anything besides streaming. I'm just enjoying my free time. So I'm, I'm not going to school either. Yeah, so what do you, so what do you that's the question is, the, the fans want to know, Sam, what are you doing in your free time? Just hanging out with friends, Fair playing enough. League of Legends, having a fun time, playing a lot of playing a lot of LOL, huh? Yep. I can dig it. Did Boss CR qualify? No, he did not. Mo did not qualify. The baby also did not qualify. Um, someone mentioned the baby in the YouTube chat. Um, the baby, uh, solid solid E Barb's uh, rage player, but that's about it. So let's see, Schwarzen and Elsiop. Am I? Hey, by the way, I've been trying to get better at my German pronunciations. Am I hitting that Schwarzen pretty well? It's pretty good. Schwarzen. Schwarzen. Yeah, sounds good. A little, little more on the A. I get it now. All right. Let's see. Take a look at the groups on the left-hand side here as we go through our first three. Um, whoever that is leading Group A, I wish I remembered who that is. That I don't think that that's... Um, is that Rad? That might be Rad, actually, leading Group A. Um, Mugi obviously three and zero in Group B. Morton two and one, tied with Aslan, but has the tiebreaker there because he won that matchup um, in Group C. Sandbox three and zero in Group D. Remember, only the winner of each group goes on. So Samuel Basoto also three and zero. Schwatzen still finishing things up, and if he can win this one here against Elsiop, um, that would be huge. Otherwise, he Elsiop and Air Surfer are all going to be tied two and one in Group F. Down in Group G, Dark Angel. Javi, currently number one in that group after that win over Lapo. Lapo could have taken number one, but it is Dark Angel instead. And then Bob the Rock, a.k.a. Carl the Great, a.k.a. Carol de Grote, um, currently leading Group H over Anaban, IMJP, and Demas. So, whoo boy. Lapo is old player. Um, it's just Lopkins is Lapacati, guys. F FLG, shout out. Fake Lapo game. Isn't Rad in Group B? Is Rad in Oh, Rad is in Group B. So is that who is that in leading Group A? I do not know. Um, let's see. I'm trying to figure out who is... I think that second place in Group D is... Um, I think that is... Uh, I think second place in Group D might be Meek and Booyah, but I'm not entirely sure. 
Unless, yeah, I think that's Meek and Booya. So I'm trying to remember who that would be um, in group. Oh, no, maybe Meek and is, yeah, second place in group D is Meek and Booya. So who is that leading group A? Um, group A leader is, um, oh, it's Ta. Ta. Hold on. <laughs> Who's Ta? Hold on. Let me go look through my, I like, I DM'd most of the people. It's not Tomi, is it? Is Tomi in some other group? No, Tommy's another group. I'm trying to figure out who that is. Ta. Uh, let me go look. I'll go look at um. Let me go look at all the uh, the people who qualified here, and let's go see if we can get um. If we're starting second half yet, second half. So we're still waiting for first half to finish, guys. Um, let me go and look up something here real quick. So at this stage, Sam, because we you know we're we're getting this is now going to be month number three. Like who do you th- who do you think is the best player of 2021 so far? I think uh, Morton or Mohamed Light or maybe I don't know. Mini mentioned Mini mentioned did pretty well in the previous two months, but not this month. Yeah, this month he didn't even make the top thousand, which I believe I heard that part of his struggle was that his account wasn't maxed. And then, like, all the cards, basically, like, the cards that were really, basically, he had a whole lot of trouble like, adjusting to the, the new meta, because he had, like, a bunch of Cycle stuff maxed. And then Cycle got blown out of the water in this uh, last ladder push. I don't know if that's enough to say why you wouldn't make top 1,000, but I know that I did hear that that was a big part of it. Okay. I didn't know that, actually. Let's see. All right, so I think that we have... Oh, AC's playing again. Let's go ahead and throw, throw AC up there for a minute. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. AC against Clam from Arby's. Which, by the way, if you're going to Arby's, don't order the Clam. Like, first of all, why are you going to Arby's, right? It's the meats. But definitely don't order the seafood at Arby's. For the love of God, please. Um, oh, what is your Battlefy ID? <sighs> Sam, go ahead and DM me that. Do you have Battlefy or no? Yes, I do. Yeah, DM me your uh, Battlefy ID, okay. and I will send it to... The people to get you to get you added. Perfect. I will boom, 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 boom. Um, all right, so there, here's our. We'll keep our standings going here. Okay, so that's Ta in first place. Who I don't know who Ta is. This guy is coming out of nowhere. Never heard of him before. Where is Ruben? I'm guessing he's in Spain. Is my 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 main guess here, guys. Um, if I were to happen a guess, you know what? Let's go with, um, we'll throw up Modic, who is um, a Scottish caster. Um, while we're, well, so we have gameplay on the screen while we're doing this. Modic was uh, one of the uh, co-casters. Modic and Ashtax were the other duo casting the world cyber games in China in the summer of 2019. Second in Group D is Mikan Booyah. Okay, that is Mikan. got it. Morton, please. No, um, guys, we're waiting on the players right now. Um, uh, Latak saying, I know most of the Japanese names by this point, just so used to figure out who is who. Yeah, well, I know who M- I know Mugi now, right? That's he's. Uh, you can see him in second place here in Group B, or in first place in Group B. Um, let's see. Oh yeah, let me get your. Okay, let me copy. Yeah, that. I sent you the Thank IP, you. Um, Discord. I'm adding you over to the, um, and that's with the proper capitalizations too. Right, like it's all that's. There's no capital letters. Uh, nope. There, there you go. All right, getting you added right now. And then you have the bracket, right? Yeah. Yeah, cool, cool, cool. What happens when two players finish forward two? Ayush asking that in the YouTube chat. Um, They have to fight with swords to see who goes on. It seems brutal, but um, this is serious business. So if two players both finish four and two, it's a, it's a, it's a death fight. Which, you know... So um, there's no tiebreaker? I mean, the, the, t- the tiebreaker is um, whoever is still standing after five minutes with a katana. So, you know, it's this is Sierra 2021. We told you guys it would be different, Sam. Aren't you glad you didn't you, you didn't make top 32 now that you don't have to have to sword fight your way to the top eight? Uh, you like, like your chances? being top 32? <laughs> you, you like your chances in the sword fights? Yeah. I, I feel you. It's actually crazy. Like it's so hard to get into top thirty-two, and then you need to get first in a group of four people. Yeah, no, it's so hard, which makes it so crazy that um, Line and Mini Minter both did it twice. That's so nutty. 
Like, do it. I, I don't know. I mean, any, I don't know if anyone who's even in this. Let's see. Who in this? Let me go. I, yes, actually, some of them have been. All right. Who in this has made top 32, has made the top eight before? Is Morton the only one who's made top eight before here? Let's see. Uh, um, Airsurfer. Oh, yeah. Morton and Air Surfer both. Man, they're so good. They're so good at this game. Um, yeah, I think they're the only two who've made top eight before, right? Now I'm trying to, trying to think about that. Tiebreakers head to head, then games one. Oh, and then sword fight. Got it. The baby versus Morton is the match I want to see. I agree, man. Um, what I want to see is our is our next round going starting. They're getting ready to start second half. How long is the stream going? Um, probably about. Are we in second? This is second half now. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Um, this stream's probably going to go another. I, I don't know. I guess an hour or so. Maybe an hour and a half. Depends on how long these games take to play. Basically, as soon as we're done with all the games, then we're good. Sword fight is sus. Game sound. Um, game sound will be on the left. Game sound is only for that side of the screen. Um, so we're just this this side. This side has no game sound. This side because we don't want game sound for two games at the same time. Um, so this is like this is the official like this is what we're mostly focusing on when things are happening. This is like the second screen. Um, Samuel Soto has also made top eight. Oh, Samuel also made top eight. Oh, uh, yeah, yes. That's right. That's right. Um, guys, sometimes I forget things. Jeez, but yeah, Samuel did make top eight. That's right. Did you get added? But do you have access now, Sam? Uh, how do I check that? Um, try to like log, go to the go to the bracket and see if you can like see all the internal stuff. Oh, okay. Yeah, and you know what? I will. Um, let me give you the link here in case you don't have the proper link. Um, it says that he it says it just added you. Okay, good. Guys, we'll have gameplay here in just a second. Oh, here we go. Um, so let's go ahead on this side of the screen. Let's just get a game going. We'll uh, go ahead and put up mm, Awesome MK, see who he's playing against. And then on the main screen, on the main screen, we'll go ahead and check out. we gotta, we got to watch Moogie and Jupiter King. How do you not watch that? How do you not watch that? So let's go. We're going to watch Moogie and Jupiter King on the main screen. Um, do you have do you, do you have it yet, Sam or no? Ah, uh, nope. Right, Did you send me the link? Oh, please? I sent you, you the link right now. Boom, there's the link. Thank you. Do I know who's leading it in points? Um, you can find all that information uh on I think the official channel on the official website, and also royalapi.com. I think has the points. I think I think Line is currently the leader in points. Um, I could be incorrect there. And guys, there will be game sound once this screen starts. Once this screen gets going. Who's my number one pick to win Worlds? Well, with Sam on the line, um, it's got to be Morton. If he wasn't on the line, <laughs> I don't know if I would have to. I, I'd have to. I, it, it, he'd be in at least. He'd be in my top ten, in my top five. But I don't know if I would necessarily. If you okay, Sam, let's put it this way: If you can't pick Morton, who do you think wins Worlds? I think either Mohammed Light, Lion, or Airsofer. Line good, is actually insanely good, good at these tournaments. Yeah, I mean, people, people, I, I, like on the West, I don't think they give Line the credit because he's a like he's in the East, and b he's not like the most out, like he's not super like outgoing and bombastic the way some of the other players are. Um, but Line no tilt, one no tilt world championship, and then so he's already done one of these crazy tournaments, and then now what he's done so far in this is just nutty. It's just nutty. Here we go. We're trying to get. This uh, this match going. Um, Momo is first in points right now. Is he? Mm, I can check. No, oh, cool. The Let player on the top is spelled yeah. Gunesh um, Gunsh Aslan, which means young. Yeah, Mo and Line is first. Mo is first right now. Okay. Yeah, Line is second, and third is Igor. Fourth is Morton. So probably after today, Morton is going to be higher up. Yeah, uh, if if Martin if Morton makes it to the top eight, he'll definitely be higher up. Hold on, let me. You see that see that professional work muting my mic to the stream there before I sneeze. That's that's the sign of a pro. I don't, I don't even have my cough button here. Normally I have my cough button set up, but as I'll even show you guys, my stream deck is off right now, so I can double screen this. Momo is first. Did I see Mo go eighteen and one in the gems? I, I I only got to cast one thing of gems. I was supposed to cast the finals. Then they changed the 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 time on me for the finals. 
so I couldn't cast finals. Um, all right, trying to get this, trying to get this matchup between Jupiter and Moogie on screen because come on, because come on, is Igor not playing? Igor did not make this. Can you say hello to Sam? Um, Brad caught. Um, Brata says hello to you, Sam. Hello. Nailed it. <laughs> Nailed it. Um, Ali is going to face Todd. We'll decide who might be first in grit in that group. Okay, we'll check that out. Um, please say to Sam. Um, no, no, I'm not saying something in German to Sam on stream. Guys, I'm not reading some random stuff in a different language I don't speak on stream. Are you insane? Like, the, the number of awful things I could say because I don't know what you're trying to make me say. I'm not falling for that. I, do you think I was born yesterday? I'm a grown man out there trying to get me to read something in a foreign language that I don't know what I'm saying. I played that trick on Friends. We had a, ex an exchange student. Um, from Brazil when I was a senior in high school. And we played that trick on him all the time. Now, he he played along. Uh, shout out Rafael down in Sao Paulo. Um, but, yeah. No, I'm not doing that. I'm, th I'm no fool. But, Sam, if you want to read to yourself whatever new Patek put in the YouTube chat, go ahead and hit it. But I'm not I'm not falling for that trap. Nope. Me neither. <laughs> but it's in German. You'd know if it was obscene or not. Just I wouldn't. Here we go. Moogie and Jupiter King. Let's go. Both running graveyard, it looks like. Canicart GY Mortar still pretty meta. Pretty meta indeed. And now on the right hand side of your screen, looks like Awesome MK probably has this one. But we'll see if like a full send here can get something out of it. Where do you put Moogie on the uh, on the top ten list right now? He's on the top ten list. Without, yeah, for sure. Right? So where do you put him on that list right now? I don't know. Thing is, he actually hasn't played the first qualifiers. I don't know why. He slept through it. What the? Yeah. Nice. <laughs> yeah, he and Hajime both forgot to set their alarms. And the, the it must be tough dealing with different time zones here, but... Not the first young Japanese superstar to, to sleep through sleep through a yeah, match. But you can you can choose your own tournament. You can choose your own time zone. Well, I think he made the top thirty two and then slept through it. Nice. Yeah, exactly. Um, who's Morton playing against right now? Let me check. Let's see. Also, who have we not seen very much of? Oh, Morton's not playing right now. There you go. Um, let's see, JP, I think, is playing against someone. Oh, JP Anaban, great. Great, there we go. JP Anaban on one screen, Jupiter King and Moogie on the other. That's what's up. Did Morton make it this month? Yes, Morton is in, and he's currently leading his group, guys. Does Buff Max still play competitive, ass? Uh, Meneer De Pierre. Um, nope, mm -hmm. does not. Not really, no. Oh, no, Latak says no. In the first, he's up to the Swiss bracket. Then second month had school in the round robin, so he went 0-6. Oh, that's what's going on with him. So he slept through the Swiss bracket. There you go. And then second month had to skip because of school. There, that's what it is with Moody. Um, thank you, Latak, for the for the, for the the correct news reporting. Mikey with the $7 Canadian up in the YouTube chat. Thank you, Mikey. Get it. Nice double screen. Yes, thank you, Matt. Trying to give you guys as much Clash Royale as possible today. Nice connection on the left-hand side. Cannon Cart. Do you, th I mean, do you think that, can where do you, like, how do you tier Cannon Cart now with the change in speed? It's, it's still good. Still good. Just, like, it's more, it's better and slowly, like, beat down decks, not... As good as a bridge fam decks as it used to be. Like in these kind of bridge fam lock bait decks, it's not that good anymore. But if you, for example, play Cannon Card Graveyard, it's like maybe even better than before. Yeah, Cannon Card GY. Better, better than the before. Is it because it allows more time? To... Yeah, you have more time to build a bigger push. That's so fascinating. Uh, Rich and Sam, who is the greatest player in Clash Royale? Um, I don't know. We'll. F I guess 2021 will tell us, right? I guess so. All right, let's go ahead it's and... crazy. Yeah, let's see. Oh, well, there's Morton playing. Oh, Morton did add me. Oh, thanks, Morton. Morton up against Cooper. Now, Cooper's the only guy who beat him in the first round robin here, so 
Let's see if Cooper can repeat that fact. Morton going RG Motherwitch. Shout out Fat Fingers 2.0. Batman with $5 in the YouTube chat. Thank you, sir. And check that out. Oh, this came down pretty close here. But Jupiter takes game number one off of Moogie. Dawid saying, I think Cannon Cart is trash. Um, well, CRO Western Champion OP Sam says you're wrong. So, you know, fight him. Oh, that's not right. I didn't want to go to Discord. I wanted to go to this. <laughs> I mean, everyone's going to have their own opinion. No, no, but... no, they can't. There, No one can have different opinions, Sam. It's everyone has one opinion or get out of here. All right. Yeah. No. So that's how it works. Yep. There are no opinions. There's facts. And the facts are what I say is true. And what I say is that what you said is true. So those are the facts now. Try to give everyone their own opinion. Nope. There's no freedom here. Let's see if I can find us another game. Uh, you know what? We're going to finish out the, We're going to finish out Jupiter Moogie. We'll finish out Jupiter Moogie. And then we'll find something different on the other one. Uh, just what because Surge was so that? good for so long. Okay, so <clears throat> so currently, so this is a, a, a long time debate. Um not taking not even saying like who's the best right now, but if you take just their career as a player, who has the best professional career? <clears throat> like who's who's the best play who's the greatest player of all time if you take their whole career into account? I mean, if you take the entire career, you probably have to say Sochikal. It's hard to, it's hard not to, right? Yep. So or maybe Elsiab. Elsiab has yeah. pretty much won anything in the Asian scene. Not to mention a world championship. But of course, so has Surge. So that's a that's a tough argument. That's a tough question. But yeah, LC LCOP's been here's the thing is this is what's crazy about LCOP. Not only did he win like five out of six championships that he competed in for, for CRL in terms of league, he also won a world championship. Um, second place at the Asian Championship, which is why Little Chen ended up getting put on Nova. Um, because he was like, oh, if you beat me, well, you have to be on my team now. Um, and then, but on top of all that, he's still here right now. He's still this good. We need... There we really need... aren't many players that are as good as, like, Elsio. For that long, the OGs. Most OGs, of, uh, they've quit the game already. And the OGs who the OGs who aren't around just like haven't stayed at that same crazy level that he stayed at. Yeah, that's a good lightning. And that's a good NATO, but it's not going to get there. Actually, Cooper's pretty low in elixir now. Can Morton hold and punish three hundred nine to four seventy nine? One thirty seven here. That he has the lightning wins. block though. Can he? Morton wins. Can Morton block this lightning? Oh, but not enough elixir. Not enough elixir. Through, yeah. What a cycle. There you go. GG. GG's Morton. Well played. And here we go. Let's go again. No, I didn't make it. Say didn't what? make it this month. I went 7 and 4 this month. Did not make it, unfortunately. Are you always someone in the chat asking about it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, Sam will be here. Sam will be here. But you know what? From a selfish perspective, I'm glad to have you here on the stream. <laughs> I like having you here on the stream. But who did you have on the stream last time? Dippets? Um, I don't know if I had someone last month. Uh, Dip has been on the stream a lot. I don't I don't know if Dip's really doing much with CR these days. Um, let's see. Let's go ahead and check in on Jack. Um, guys, you know what we need? Okay, I was trying to say this earlier. Guys, and I don't know if C Clash Royale Esports is in the YouTube chat. Sometimes they are. I know it's a bit early right now. But if Clash Royale Esports YouTube is in the YouTube chat, guys, everyone tell them right now, we need a CR, a Clash Royale Hall of Fame. We need like an e like a CR, like an esports wing and a creator wing and a whatever it is. But we need a Clash Royale Hall of Fame. We are in year five of the game. We have so many players and creators and stuff like that who are deserving of that kind of, that sort of recognition. And so Dark Angel is so no Dark Angel is not Javi Catorze. Dark Angel's name is also Javi. But just like Javi Catorze, Dark Angel they have the same name because. More than one person can have the same name. I don't know if you know that. Um, I'm not the only rich. I am the only. You know what? There's like one other rich slate, but he goes by Richard Slate. So, boom, got it. But, um, dude, you gotta. We need to have a Clash Royale Hall of Fame. Um, and I, I, I really should. It's one of those things that should happen this year, in my opinion. I would like if they added 
titles into the game. For example, under your name, instead of showing the client, it shows the title, for example, World Champion for Sergio. Uh, Something like that would be cool. That would be really cool. That would be really cool. Um, New Patek wants to know what cards to use in a triple log bait deck. I don't know. Um, you can ask Sam, but also you can go to Royal API, which will have all of that. What is a triple log bait deck like? Goblin Barrel, Skate Barrel, Wall Breakers, or what? I guess so. Uh, let's go ahead and bring up Schwarzen as he goes up against uh, Himawari. Him Will the real Rich Slayton please stand up? Uh, hopefully get back to stand-up comedy pretty soon, guys. Now that I'm I am fully... I got my, my second vaccination shot yesterday, so close to be able to go back on stage here. I'm very excited about it. Um, let's see. Piggy's in to the right-hand side. So are you watching Jupiter and Moogie right now? Yeah. So what do you think about this matchup here? I don't know. Actually, I think it's not that bad for Moogie. Just the start was bad. That's why it's losing right now. But yeah, is he coming back? Oh, my word. 6 HP. I think he is. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, no, way. no way. No way. No way. <laughs> No he way! He did not know the arrow damage. Oh my lord. This isn't ladder, Jupiter King. This is tournament standard. Oh my word. Oh my word. That's bananas. That's bananas. Yeah, I had someone ro trying to rocket cycle me yesterday, and he didn't know what rocket did apparently, and I beat him by like 4 HP, and I could not stop laughing. <laughs> I mean, it's pretty simple. You can just check the damage. Hold the card, check the damage. Just make yourself a just make yourself a cheat sheet, at the very minimum. All right, so tied up now. That's gonna be tied up between. We're gonna go. We're gonna we're gonna stick around and watch game number three of uh, Moogie and Jupiter. We're not missing that one. So let's go ahead and take a look at the right hand side of the screen where Himu Himawari Himawari. Man, I, I need to get that. I need to get that down. He's new. Um, but <laughs> where he and Schwarzen are going for it, Schwarzen with a double bait deck. And Goblin Barrel in. Going to get some shots. Boom! Schwarzen takes the win. Did I see your question, Balthazar, about Jason? What? Who's Jason? Um, <coughs> was Jason... Cooper. Say what? Morton's now in a game against Cooper. Oh, he is? All right. I'll go ahead and throw that up. Um, boom. There we go. Um, I don't know. If Jason was the first player to win a Clash Royale. Yeah, sure. That sounds like a thing to be in. If J sure, Jason. Yeah, I remember. You remember I that? Remember. Yeah, he was using Giant Pump with Barbs and Main Horde and Hog Rider. Okay, here's my, here's my question. For, okay, here's a question for you. Is 3M viable again or no? Uh, yes. 3M are, they are actually pretty good. It's just the fact that they don't really fit into the meta. Like, there's a lot of Fireball. Pretty much everybody's using Fireball right now. EQ is pretty broken against Pump, so it's kind of like they're good, but not in this meta. But are they better for ladder than competitive, or better for competitive than ladder? I think better in competitive, because just because in competitive there's not many expo players, and if you face expo with three musketeers on ladder, you can just give up. Oh, fair enough. Oh, look at this. Here we go. Morton pulling it all together. G, G to the G, well to the played. Morton takes that game off of Cooper. That should be game number one, I believe. Um, oh yeah, um, Sam, you could post on your, tw like, someone just said you could post on your Twitter that you're co-casting with me. Uh, yeah. Here, I'll do that. <laughs> that's someone, well, someone just, I guess people will want to know, right? Um, as, uh, the, the people want to know, Sam, um, and then the link, what you want, the link to the stream is on the, uh, is on my Twitter if you want to grab it. Um, but it's fun, it's, it is so much fun to have you here, man. Let's mm -hmm. see. Let's see. Um, Rich Slayton. That's who I am. That's what I've been told at least. <laughs> Let's go check out Yusuf here for a minute. See who Yusuf is up against. Up against Crisp Tarta. We'll give them a little bit, a little bit of love here in their final two minutes as we wait for the next game of this Moogie Jupiter King. Game number three, the deciding game. Come on, Moogie and Jupiter. I want to see you guys figure out who is the 
best between you two. And this will decide it forever, by the way. Whoever wins this next one is forever better than the other person. That's how Clash Royale works. If you win one BO3, you are forever better than that person. Until the next BO3. All right, let's go ahead and check in on um, Rafael Menezes, who's up against Higher. Uh-oh. Um, Uh-oh. One of the players declined the game invite. Uh-oh. Watch B-Rad. Go to his channel to watch him. He's not in this tournament. I don't know if B- has B-Rad been, been finishing, has been, like, pushing ladder at all? He has. I think he's finished top 1K recently. Not sure. I don't know if he's actually but I don't think he's interested. I don't think he's interested in competitive. Yeah. He's more interested in making content. Sure. You know, you wonder if that sort of thing is content, but to each his own. Let's take a look at Jack and Elsie Op. Um, and then we'll try to get this game going. Um, let's see. Get in here for the day two monthly qualifier. Oh, yeah, get in there. Get in there, guys. Hold on. Trying to make trying to make all these things happen. Um, minor poison content. Yeah. Uh, Moogie Three Crown Jupiter and CRL Worlds last year says Samuel Greenberg. People do Three Crown people. Guys, if you haven't yet on the YouTube, by the way, I haven't been putting the sub chat, the sub link in there a whole bunch because I usually have a button that I press that says subscribe to my channel. But if you haven't yet, subscribe to my channel. We're at like 20,000 something and now we're on that push to 30K. So if you're watching on YouTube right now and you appreciate Sam being here, you appreciate me being here, you think my glasses are fresh, you like Clash Royale, you don't like Clash Royale, you drink water, you exclusively drink Gatorade, whatever it is that you do, hit that subscribe button right now. Show a little love. It's a free way to support me and to support competitive Clash Royale. So go ahead, subscribe to my channel. Timothy McCleary talking about not free ways. $5 super chat. Love the casting as always. Still wish this gameplay would rub off on my ladder push. Dude, I know how you feel. I've been there. I've been there. Look at the amount of damage. Okay, I made a tweet. You made a tweet? Yes. Guys, Sam so made a tweet. Can get some more people. Oh my, Anna, what's up? Sam made a tweet. Can you say hello to XOPX and Alina? Hold on, here I go, trying to get this. Oh, you, you you linked the Twitch. That's hilarious. All right. Well, I'll, I'll, I'll retweet that one. Oh, Twitch and YouTube. Uh, boom, boom, boom. I got it. There we go. Um. Uh, yeah, that's a good answer to the question. Um, that but that someone asked. Someone asked if I think that's that. Um, Jupe, that surgical should or should not have left the game. I think that if that any whenever you decide to stop playing competitive, and that's anything. When you're like, hey, I want to retire from playing basketball professionally. Whenever you say you at your time to retire, it's basically it is the correct time to retire. I don't think that anyone yes. ever no almost nobody retires too early. Many people retire too late. That's Honestly, why. you should retire at your best moments so people have you in good memory. Because if you just keep on playing and start being washed and then retire after, people are just gonna like remind you, like have your memory as a washed player. Yeah, guys. Um, no, sa- there is sound, but the sound is on this. Um, is only on this screen, guys. So I'm trying to. Um, oh, we're already in round two for for some of this. Um, well, let's go ahead and find. We've been waiting so long. Wait. Moogie, how is Moogie losing? How is Moogie losing the game to to Rad when he's still in his match against Jupiter King? That makes no sense. That makes yeah, absolutely no. That's make no sense. Um, well, let's get a game on here. Still, I'm trying to. I really want to get that Moogie. You know what? Let's go Lapo and Jack. That's. I mean, if we're gonna put a game on while we're waiting. Oh well, I guess that that, that Lapo won that. So never mind. Oh my! Jack oh, come defending on. this. Ah! Come on, Jacko. It's close. EQ, log. Does that Magic Archer get a shot? Magic Archer gets a shot. Uh, oh, only one. Th- oh, no. LZ Op takes the win. GG, LZ Op. Look at how much King Tower damage there was in that one, by the yeah, way. Yeah, that was insane. That was nutty. Let's see if we can get Moogie Jupiter King to actually play here. Oh, come on. Well, I've been trying to. This is the game. I've been trying to get th- this game three to be the game, guys, but it's not working. So I'll go get a different game on over here. Um, let's go ahead and put on. Um. Oh, thank you very much. Mrs. Slayton just came in with some food. Can I get some food? I'm hungry. No, no food for you. No food for you. Um, let's see if I can get Morton and Awesome. No, there. So we're kind of in like a in a weird play. 
Um, Rad sent request to Moogie, but Moogie needed one more against Jupiter King. Got it, got it, got it. Let's see if that Moogie Jupiter King game is going to happen here. Um, all right, you know what? We're gonna put let's let's get any game with sound on because we've been with no we. So guys, the screen that you see that has all the all this stuff, this is the screen that has sound on. Um, so if you're like, whoa, there's no sound, yes, because I only have sound coming through one of these two screens, guys. Otherwise, we would have too much sound. Um, okay, Bob's not in a game right now. All right, you can see no one's in a game right now, guys, from the right-hand screen. So um, let's go back and see if maybe we can get the Moogie Jupiter King Game 3 when it comes up. And we're kind of like hold. everyone's being held off here as this one gets going. Um, yeah, so this de this device is the one that has that is our, ma our main screen, guys. But as you can see, I have almost everybody in the tournament on the friends list here, or like a lot of the players. No one's really in the game because we're all waiting for this Moogie Jupiter King thing to go. Um, I think Air Surfer is out. I don't think so, but I could be wrong. Um, hold on. So Mrs. Slayton bought, uh, brought me food. I'm gonna take my my I'm gonna take my face off the screen here to eat this because I don't feel like getting memed with the particular food that she brought me. So give me a second here. Uh, boom. Turn, turn myself off. Mmm. <laughs> Mm. Get some ASMR going on. Yeah, all ASMR, you guys are crazy. <laughs> but guys, we're just waiting right now. We just don't have any games going, guys. I'll throw a random game. Here you go. Um, there you go, Mikey, who's one of our one of my supporters in the stream a lot, and he's in my clan a lot of the time. Oh, he's he's not. In, he's actually in, in non meta Musketeers right now. But I'll throw some gameplay on screen while we're waiting. Let's see. Thoughts on the Bolshevik Revolution of October nineteen seventeen. Um, solid revolution. Well executed. That's my thoughts. High level. Crisp Tarda. Here we go. We got some gameplay on this screen. Guys, I'm just trying to make sure we get game three of this Jupiter King Moogie matchup. But for some reason, it's still getting all goofy. So sorry there's no sound. You know, I'll put, I can put some music back on while we wait. Where's my music? Wait, it's not on? Where's the music? There's my music. Here, here's some, here, this should be some music for you guys. When does this end, M-E-L? It never does. It never does. Wubba dub dubify. Wow, no game time. I can hear you eat. Are you kidding me? Um, you know what? Actually, I can, I'm going to really make sure you hear me eat. Hold on. Mmm. Oh, this is so tasty. Mmm. Really? Oh, you're leaving? Sorry. There is game sound, guys. Just none of the games that I, the game I'm trying to get on the main screen isn't there yet. So, guy who is out, you'll be missed. You'll be missed so much. I can't believe you're leaving. I'll put myself back on camera now. I just want to say I'm so sad that you're leaving, guy who is upset. It's an interesting I, little deck by Yusuf. I wonder if he downloaded the video. I think you would do a decent. You would do decent at GTA. RP? Not sure what that means. Got him. Yeah. No, I, whenever someone says, I don't like this, it just hurts me so much. It's really hard to me to handle. Um, hey, Meno, it's me. If you see my comment, please reply. Cool. Oh, role playing. Oh, yeah. I, dude, I would love to be... I should be a character on GTA for sure. Still trying to get this... Still trying to get this third game between these guys. You know what? We're just gonna we're we're gonna abandon it because they're never gonna play. They are stuck in never playing for the rest of eternity. Is Morton in the game? Nope. Nope. Okay. Well, he's not even online right now. What is happening? Is there a break? No. We should just be playing right now. Um. Oh, you know what? Is this sandbox? And I think that this is. Um, that one's no, no one's. Why is nobody playing? It appears Moogie is still talking about the admin. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Op Sam's Twitter. Um, if you go to my Twitter, Vincent, you'll be able to find Op Sam's Twitter. My God, can I get a game on the main screen, please? Please, please, can I get a game on the main screen? Let's go with maybe Demas and and nobody's playing. Sam, you're my fave. Can you tell him that? Um, Hamza says he, that you're his favorite, dude. Thank you. I appreciate it. You're pretty up there on my list, dude. If people ask me who my favorite players are, and I generally decline to talk comment on it, but you're definitely very high on my favorite players list. 
I appreciate it. Thank just, you, sir. Just wanted to share that emotional moment with you right now. Is, is Icy on that list? Oh, yeah, for sure. Um, <laughs> Rich got in with the, this ain't an airport and I did announce your departure. That's funny. Um, it's Meek and Booyah. Yeah, that is Meek and Booyah, right? So try, I want to, I'd love to watch Sandbox. We haven't watched Meek and Booyah play yet. I would love to watch these guys go, but no one's playing. I have, you can see the, the list over here. No one's playing. No one's doing anything. We're all just sitting here trying to figure out, will Moogie and Jupiter King ever play Clash Royale or are they done playing Clash Royale for the all, for, for eternity? Has it ended? Eternity. That's one of the top players out of Turkey to bring that conversation back. Oh, yeah. Golem one trick. Golem one trick, but ended up doing pretty well at the World Cyber Games. Um, Jack, um, the, the, the uh, Jack, Japanese Jack, not Air Surfer, said on direct stream that he'll use 2.6. Ooh, that's fun. That's a lot of fun. Yeah, so here you go, guys. Nobody's doing anything. They're all doing nothing. How's them burritos? Uh, dude, I still have, guys, it's somewhere, where is it? Unopened, but here's still the gold leaf. The golden burrito will happen. The golden burrito will occur. Just has not, not occurred yet. Um, any the link golden for this, burrito? The golden burrito? Um, well, I when I, I my whole thing was when I hit 20K, I'm going to eat a burrito. I ordered, Sam, this is, I don't know if you can see the stream, but I have a packet yeah, here I'm, of I'm edible watching. gold leaf. You know, Mohammed Light plays Clash Royale on a golden chair. I eat actual gold. How about that? So I'm going to get a burrito. I'm going to wrap it in gold leaf. and going to eat a golden burrito on stream. Just have to like find the correct stream for it. I wanted to oh, do man. it today, but I didn't. Kind of reminds me of a Mr. Beast video. Oh, yeah? I've never seen a Mr. Beast video. I have not seen a single. The only reason I even know Mr. Beast exists because, is because everyone retweets him on Twitter. Um, well, maybe you should go and uh, watch a video. I guess. I guess I should, but. Um, yeah, he made a video where he ate like in a restaurant and everything was wrapped in golden paper. Good for him, man. But he has a lot more money than I do. <laughs> but this is, this is, here you go. Edible gold leaf, guys. Here's the nutritional facts on the back. For those of you who want to know about edible gold leaf. And I'm going to be eating a golden burrito. There you go. Um, let's see. Oh, oh, it was FMGG, not Eternity. Good call. Good call there, Killua. Um, by the way, Killua provided like a motion gra a motion designed version of this overlay, but I couldn't test it and get it loaded in in time for today's stream. But for next month, we should um, Killua Graphics, who's in the YouTube chat, uh, make some really he does uh, he does a uh, what's about thumbnails for lots of people, design lots of people. He designed this overlay and designed a motion version of this overlay, which we will debut next month for the for the qualifiers. Just we couldn't get it couldn't get it sorted out in time. So you can see nobody's playing, guys. That's why we're hit, hanging out here. It's because nobody's playing. Um, so let's. Why see is nobody we, playing? Is there an issue? I think they're still trying to wait. Maybe they're maybe they're holding up the entire. Um, Lapo versus Kevin round two is live. Oh, interesting. Let me go and see. Let me, let's see if I can find that one. Because, let's see. Where's Lopkins? Lopkins and Kevin. Okay, they are live. Great. We have a game. Um, are you excited for Germany versus Italy in the No Tilt Worlds? Nope. Okay. <laughs> Solid answer there. I mean, uh, I'm uh, really honestly, I'm not really into the Clash Royale Worlds thing just because, I mean, in soccer, for example, it's something special. Every four years, there's the World Championship. Meanwhile, in Clash Royale, every like half year, there like. There's a World Championship, and most of the time, the organization is pretty bad, and that's why I don't like it. Okay. not Guys, if you want real opinions, you have them coming here right now from the Mad Scientist himself. Not holding back. But speaking of not holding back, full send here from Kevin. But the Miner does get picked up. Bat's not going to get in. Can Fireball do it? No, not going to happen. 12.06 to 12.74. Lapo taking what I believe is game one. Not entirely sure. Who knows? Let's go. But shout out for Lapo. Um, you should renounce on Twitter before you eat the golden burrito. We don't want to miss a special event. Strong move, dude. It'll be content. I'll make a video about it. It'll be everywhere. So still, most people not playing. Let's go ahead back into the overall thing here. Wow, we were at a, we were we were this thing was going at pace, right? This whole thing was really moving quickly, and then um, and it slowed way the heck down because of this Moogie Jupiter King 
uh, conundrum. And I don't see Jupiter in game on, because I think I have Jupiter here on the friends list, right? Yeah, he's not currently in game. So there you go. I love that his battle deck, he, his battle deck is currently the Goblin Giant Sparky Rage. That's actually hilarious. Um, so we're trying to see. I'm, I'm, let me go ahead and see if what, the, what sort of update there is here. <laughs> that deck on the profile. Ew. Yeah, that deck on the profile is hilarious. That's That makes me laugh real hard. Let's see. Is this game going to ever happen? Still being... I'm gonna, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and ask admins what's happening with that. I think everyone's being delayed because of this whole Jupiter Moogie situation. Because it's delaying a bunch of matches. Um, Wait, what's the issue in between that match? I don't know. I honestly don't know. Did someone repeat a card or something? No sure. Um, no idea. Hold on. Um, well, let's see. Let me go ahead and check uh, into the into the CRL like admin chat. What's going on? One second with uh, with Mugi versus Jupiter and the delays. Boom! I'm asking chat. I'm asking admins. We'll see what happens. As you can see, people not really in a game. Um, let's go ahead and watch Modic. Lapakati was in Mortals and he was in uh, Space Station Gaming. In case you guys are curious, um, I mean, Mugi I can go went into a ladder match as well. Oh, that's hilarious! Oh, you can't. Oh yeah, we'll watch you. I'll watch you play. Yeah, let's let's put you up playing ladder. Wait, can I? Can you give me a deck? Can I give you a deck? Yeah. Um, let's see. What am I? What am I? What am I playing right now? I I started playing two point uh, three point zero last night just for fun. You know what? Um, three M Royal Hogs. So three M Royal Hogs. Yeah, let's Any let's go other... throwback twenty eighteen. Three M Royal Hogs Hunter, Ice Golem, Dark Prince, Bar Barrel, Fireball, Heal Spirit. All right. Let's go. Let's see if there's a game on. If there's a official game on. Nope, no official game on. So as soon as Sam's into a game, we'll have something. Hey, whoa! Let's go ahead and we'll put up uh, we'll put up Lapo and um, Kevin round two. Spaceman Spiff saying five dollar super chat. Shout out to my boys Cullen and Dash, new fans. I didn't have to remember what sunlight looks like. Stay classy, rich. Hey, be excellent to each other. And shout out to Cullen and Dash. Thank you very much for the support, man. Do appreciate it. And there you go. Sam is in a ladder match. We'll have that going on our second screen here as we um, check out Lapo versus Kevin. Kevin running double bait. Uh, and of course, Sam here. Wait, skeletons? Wait, are there no skeletons? No, you you amended my deck. I think that I had heal spirit. I don't know if you have heal spirit. Yeah, I do have heal spirit as well. Uh, I had ice golem, I think, instead of skeletons. I do have ice golem as well. I, mean, I, had... I, I, don't, I don't have fireball. Oh, yeah, I had fireball in this deck, I think. Okay. I think I did. You know what? I'll tell you in a minute. Oof. Um. Heal Spirit was really popular in 2018. No, Heal Spirit didn't exist in 2018, but uh, 3M Royal Hogs was the the second half of the 2018 fall season. 3M Royal Hogs was like the most played deck. It was everywhere. And uh, let's see. Lapo and Kevin so far, no real damage done either direction. Lapo will put a little bit of chip damage on the right-hand side, but that's about it. Oh, so KFP saying that Moogie went into a different match before finishing the match versus Jupiter. Oh, interesting. Very strange. And thanks to everybody who's watching over on YouTube. If you haven't yet, subscribe to the channel. Just hit that button. And if you're on Twitch, hit the follow button. No matter where you are, hit a button that says you want to keep seeing more of me. Because obviously you want to see more of me because I'm the best. Right, guys? Fireball in on the right-hand side. And um, Sam also just playing some Clash <laughs> Royale. How do you feel about this deck so far, Sam? Do you feel like you got it? Do you feel like it's uh, the greatest deck ever? It's a good deck. Maybe not the best matchup, but it's a good deck. That Valk going hog wild on the right-hand side. Ironic because he's up against pigs. And the Princess plus Dark Goblin for Kevin going to do a lot of work against that flying machine. And really, the hope would be that you abuse the flying machine, but you play it that high, or that gets that high, and of course, a princess and dark goblin can shred. Nice arrows here from Kevin on the left-hand side. Flying machine high one more time. And this flying machine is going to be tough to deal with as long as there's some support in front of it. And flying machine gets picked up by the Valk. Princess will go to work. 
on that other screen there. As you can see, Sam here not really spamming those 3M yet. We're going to wait until probably triple to start doing a whole bunch of that. Cannon cart down into one Musketeer. Oh, double cannon cart on the right-hand side as Sam goes pig sent on the left-hand side. Dark Prince to pick up. Sam doing his work on the right-hand lane here as we're waiting for more games to happen in case you're wondering, hey, what are we, what are we doing watching Sam? We're having fun. Here we go. Lapo left-hand lane. Throws down the zap. He's a split. Two to the left, one to the right, but two princesses down for Kevin right now as he does get that next skeleton barrel. Full bait push left-hand side, and it's high with the recruits here for Lapo in response. And that's some extra splash damage from the princess on the left-hand side. Lapo in good shape now, or in bad shape now, 671 to only putting down 1677 on Kevin's right-hand tower. Rocket Cycle comes in against OP Sam on the right-hand side as he does protect that musketeer against the cannon cart in the right-hand lane. And now the Rascals to pick up the Dark Prince. Back over to the left-hand screen here. Lapo in a whole lot of trouble. Eight, 83 HP remaining. The arrows probably pretty far away. I think he already cycled them out. Rip. But it should be Kevin able to get arrows down pretty soon. Might not need them. Goblin Barrel comes out. Barb Barrel not there. Kevin gets the win. And then over on Sam's side, that's going to be the GG, the well played. Rough <laughs> deck that I gave Sam here. Rough matchup for him. I but think that's Moogie how you. Versus Jupiter is live oh, Moogie versus Jupiter. Let's go. Okay, hold on. Let me go get it. Let's go get it. Finally. Moogie versus Jupiter. Finally going. I'm going to turn this music off, guys, because we're going to have game sounds in. Let me go ahead and um, let me go ahead and get Moogie versus Jupiter going. That was supposed to be over here. Um, here we go. Moogie versus Ju oh, that's the wrong one. Let me go back. Oh gosh, let me go back. Where are you, Moogie versus Jupiter? No, no, not the first half. Second half. Second half. Here we go. Second half. Let's go to round. Oh, no, no. The second half. Let's go round one. Second half. And where is Moogie versus Jupiter? Boom. Finally going to have this game going. There we go. Ooh. Open it. Here we go. And we're getting in a little bit late on this one. Moogie versus Jupiter. EQ cycle in for Jupiter King. E-Barb spam Jupiter at won. the bridge. Go ahead. I think he won. I think that's GG. 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 What yeah. a NATO, but the bats, but the E-Barb, e and Jupiter OP. King does win it. Man, I wish we'd seen the whole thing. Um, CBB says, hello from France. Bonjour, comment allez-vous? Je voudrais ouf de menace. Où est la bibliothèque? I took three years of French, that's all I got. Je m'appelle Richard. Um, I think, I don't know if you guys can hear, but Baby Boy Slayton sounds like he's having a rough time in the other room. Two and a half years old. Sm whip smart. Very physically strong. Occasionally has a meltdown because he's two. All right, let's see. What do we got? No one's in a game. We finally finished that round. Jupiter so the got the win. So are starting now. Yeah, I, well, I have my, I have my, um, uh, my friends list open and not much is happening here. Maybe Kevin and Lapo are back in. Although, did that finish? No, Kevin and Lapo are... Wait, what? What is happening here? Second half. Round two, which is what we're in. And it should be... Where's... Weren't Kevin and Lapo... What is going on? Um, Joker Bale saying namaste. Namaste as well. Yeah, fi yeah, th yeah. this, I forgot to charge this screen, 5% battery. Yeah, that one's almost dead. Um, but it's, it is plugged in. Um, 1,000 1, saying at Rich Slayton. What at Rich Slayton? Oh, that it's on. Um, Biblioteca is in Portuguese. Yeah, I think it's, uh, oh, Bibliotheque. Yeah, not, you don't even have to have the, the, uh, there for French. Hello from Poland. Hello from Utah, USA. Um, charge battery? Yeah, I'd, I'd love to. Can someone play Clash Royale, please? Hi, guys. I'm Rich Slate. If you want to watch people not play Clash Royale, don't forget to subscribe to this channel because this channel is a great place to watch people not play Clash Royale. Do you think sometimes, hey, I have seen too many people use the same deck? Well, guess what? You're in luck. No one's using any decks. Hit subscribe if you're on YouTube. Hit follow if you're on Twitch. And you know what? On Twitch, hit subscribe anyway. Throw me that money if you want to watch us stand here and wait for someone to play. If you don't like watching Clash Royale happen, this is the place for you. That's the ad read of the century, by the way, guys. 
It's never 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 been done that level, that level. Um, speaking of content, um, Sam, I know that you're you're streaming on Twitch a bunch. Are you doing are you doing YouTube content as well, or just streaming on Twitch? Oh uh, no, basically just streaming on Twitch right now. Clip some of those things and put them on YouTube, bro. The YouTube community wants that wants some OP Sam. Let me tell you. People on YouTube, if you're on YouTube right now, tell OP Sam how much you want to see his content on YouTube. If you're in the YouTube chat, go ahead and hit it. Be like, Sam, please put stuff on YouTube. Bring it. Because I want to show him how much he would succeed on YouTube if he brought his content over there. Here they go. Are this, is there going to be a game? Oh, I have a delay on YouTube, so uh, don't <laughs> wait for it, Sam. Uh, the baby is crying. Yeah, yeah. Little, little boy Slayton is. I want to see it. Says Neptune. Here we go. Here it comes in because the delay comes in. Andrew Nguyen says uh, agree. Isaac says we want your content on YouTube, man. Um, the Hardik Sharma says Sam, please put stuff on YouTube. Jacques says want to see Sam play best log bait. Lucas says Sam, please put stuff on YouTube. Hardik <laughs> says Sam, dude. Everyone's saying Alexander Marcado says get a YouTube channel, please. GTA. Nice. Yeah, Sam, 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 YouTube Sam, Sam. We love Sam, want him on YouTube. English content, please, big fan. Dude, at, look at this. Everyone here is saying they want you on YouTube. So I think it's decided now, Sam. You need to make a YouTube channel and take some of your best Twitch stuff and put it on YouTube. I mean, I already do have a YouTube channel, but I just, like, I have two videos uploaded, but I didn't upload in quite a while. Well, see, there's no, no better time like the present, man. This is the year of Sam on YouTube. Guess so. So I have to do a YouTube video now. You have to do YouTube videos now. It's been decided. okay. Okay. There's no. There is no argument. All right. So there's Rad versus Moogie on screen number two. Let's go ahead and check out um, Samuel and Rafael Mende. Uh, Mendez. Oh, no, that one's not. If you want to see, <laughs> like, dude, my my ad read was perfect. Um, let's see. Let's check out. Um, Where's Meek and Booyah? Meek and Booyah and Sandbox. Let's go watch that one. Spectate, here we go. Meek and Booyah and Sandbox. Let's go. Sam already made two. Yeah, dude. The, the YouTube channel, the YouTube comments right now are all about how I wanted to see you on YouTube. So. Might be because you promoted it. Yeah. Might well, just be because of that. <laughs> um, You know, I'm going to go ahead and find. I'm not even going to promote your Twitch right now. Because you guys can all find Sam on Twitch. I'm going to promote your YouTube and force you to do YouTube content. That's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna promote. I'm gonna. I'm gonna spam your YouTube link. Uh, X O P X Sam Clash Royale. Boom! I'm finding your YouTube channel right now. Um, there's his channel. And um, boom! Here's his channel. This says this channel doesn't have any content. That's weird. There's the content. All right, hold on. Let me go ahead and reload your channel here, and get the link. Hold on, I'm gonna I'm gonna get this I'm gonna get your YouTube link and this is what we're promoting today. And when we promote the heck out of this thing, you're about to get guys. Sam has 683 subs on YouTube. Let's get him to a thousand right now. Everyone, I'm not even promoting my own YouTube right now, guys. The rest of the day is promoting Sam's YouTube. We're getting into a thousand subscribers today. That's the goal. So everybody on YouTube, everybody on Twitch, click the link that I'm putting in there. Let's put Sam from 683 up to a thousand on YouTube so that we make him do YouTube content. Uh, thank you. I appreciate it. That's, bro, I'm here for you. And it looks like, uh, Sandbox is here for, for, um, for Mikambuya with this balloon on tower. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Yeah, Sandbox is definitely here for Mikambuya. King Tower in a lot of trouble as well. A lot of pressure everywhere. And people in YouTube in YouTube chat saying done, 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 done. Guys, we only need to get 300 something subscribers for you, Sam, right now, and I believe we can do it. That would be like half the viewership, or so. Hey, thank you, thank you guys for all the people that just follow. Thank you for all the followers coming in. Dude, hit him. Just got like 50 followers. <laughs> Whoa! On Twitch or on YouTube? YouTube. Oh snap! Keep going. All right. So Sandbox wins that one. On the right-hand side, it's Rad and Moogie. Remember, Moogie did lose a Jupiter King. Um, let's go ahead and find someone else. Sam's at 730 subs now. That's not enough, guys. Boom. I'm going to keep putting that link in there. Sub to Sam. 
the way to get me to stop spamming that link is you go s is sub to him. When he hits 1,000, I'll stop putting that link in chat. Ooh, I think Baby Boy Slate might be fighting a spider or something right now. He is screaming in the other room. Um, <laughs> Maybe he's just hungry. Uh, he's two and a half. I don't think he's hungry. I think he's just two and a half. Ooh, let's go take out um, Jack and Schwartz. <laughs> it's just two and a half. Nice. Yeah. It's too uh, bad, man. They melt uh, down sometimes. Okay. All right. Like, Movie is playing so much E Giant. He's always playing E Giant. Always. Yeah, it's interesting. Like, well, it's an interesting approach when you, when you come to talk when you talk about approaching these um, dual mode games, right? Like, some players create very specific game plans based on who they're facing. Um, you know, I've been talking a little bit with Julesy, who's been uh, uh, working as an analyst for a lot of a lot of players, including both Mini Minter and um, Mo Light. And, you know, talking about working with what kind of player you work with and, like, their deck variants overall. So thinking about, like, how you make your game plan, right? Is your game plan mostly about changing one or two cards based on who they're facing? Or are you, like, really changing the overall deck, like, the, the, the three-deck selection? And wow. Wow, look at that one. Rad throwing out the angry face emo. I wonder what that was all about there. I think every player has their own strategy. There's some players that just play their comfort and don't really check, like don't even check what the enemy's playing. There's players that just go for full snipe, check what the enemy's playing and try to prepare decks that are good against it. And then there's also players that have like a couple dual deck combinations prepared and then just use them as a rotation. What's but I've also one? seen, I've okay. also seen people just copy other people's strategies. For example, just looking up the decks that Moogie's playing and then just straight up copying it. Well, I mean, what's your... That's really funny. But what's your approach? Like, what do you like doing for for these sort of dual mode battles? Uh, I like checking what my enemies use, and then based on what they use, I play what... I see what they play. Fair, yeah, that makes sense from someone who's known as a more cerebral approach uh, player comes to deck, deck selection and deck creation. Oh, I guess... I mean, it really depends. I mean, sometimes you can check people like Morton, for example. He plays so many decks, you can't really snipe him. So it's kind of hard, but uh, if you play against, for example, one tricks, you can just easily get a free win by checking what they play. Right, there's Samuel versus Rafael. Here's a question for you: Who do you think is the greatest one trick of all time? Uh greatest one trick of all time. Never been that asked before. Greatest one trick of all time. Uh, I'm bringing the I real mean, questions. Can you consider? Igor is a one trick, maybe. Like, he has so many finishes with Mordor. So, or maybe Anaban. He has so many, like, two I think maybe Anaban, yes. Yeah, with the back of He's the only Although... player that uses that deck. Like, no, and nobody else is using that deck. Yeah, I will say this, which is interesting is that, like, I think he did this last season with um, Ram Rider rather than with his, with his deck, which I thought was, which I thought boded well for his chances this year. I don't know. He's he's not really a one trick, but if I would have to say, it, I mean, I think I would say Anaban. Anaban's certainly on there. Um, Dexter in the YouTube chat saying Lemon Tree best one trick, no doubt. Lemon Tree. Um, mm -hmm. Harshit saying Kid Kid. Nikhil saying Igor. Lightning Champ saying Wiro best one trick. Yeah, Vero, yeah, Vero for sure. Vero is super good with Twitch then. Maybe it's actually him. Yeah. Let's check out Faust on the on the second screen screen here up against Jupiter King, and right now Lapo in a lot of trouble. Can he beat out both the arrows and the fireball? That's gonna be real hard to do. Does that does that do enough? Does the e barb get on? Oh, needed one more shot there. Kevin takes it. Does get back to the arrows in time? Oh my word. Um, Viking saying OP Sam best one trick. Nah. No, you have at uh -huh. least two or three tricks. Yeah. I'm... I mean, I got a number one finish with. Minor wall breakers, but I'm known for Royal Hawks, so I wouldn't say I'm a one trick. There you go. I'm a no trick, which is much worse. Aren't you an Expo Skarmy one trick? <laughs> 2018 th throwback. Yeah, have Ooh. not have not played that the Expo Bowler Minor in a long Morton's time. Morton's in the game now against uh, Awesome again. All right, gonna bring Morton up on the main screen here. Um, some, some people saying Oyasu, Best NA, Mark Aureus, uh, Viper, Pompeo. 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 Pompeo as well. Yeah, Pompeo. So using that deck. And he has so many good finishes. Pompeo is like the same as Anaban, but Anaban is sniping more than Pompeo. Yeah. 
Which I support, actually. I'm pro sniping. I think it's part of that, like, people... Uh, it's like, hey, <laughs> switch up your deck on ladder, then, if you're gonna... If, if you're worried about getting sniped. Andrew. <laughs> Mortar one trick, nice. Andrew Mortar one trick, yeah. <laughs> Andrew does have a trick, at least. I have no tricks. I'm generally just mediocre all around. So, what do you think about this matchup between Morton and Awesome? I mean, delivery and log. I just he has. It's the, I think that's the hard part is he has like no way to deal with the zappies. That's the I think the hard part from in my perspective, and also he has no way to deal with the flying machine. So it feels to me like Awesome can really just abuse the heck out of the flying machine and the zappies. And correct me if I'm the wrong. The machine is great in this matchup, but yeah. also it's the scar me like. Awesome doesn't really want to lock his army. He needs to lock on defense. It's an interesting matchup. Yeah, it's really interesting. It's, yeah, I mean that's the th that's the one thing about the Skarmy, right? Is you have like the other two. You have you actually have four log targets, which is really annoying for Awesome. But if or but if Awesome can abuse the flying machine and control this defense, yeah, fireball. He has to spend it. Well, is just doing a great job right now at protecting these dark goblins. I mean, is that sort of the key to this matchup? Is the protecting the Dark Goblin versus protecting the Flying Machine? Yep. I think oh. it's easier for more to protect the Dark Goblin for uh, Austin to protect the Flying Machine. Because Morton has so many targets to pull the the log, and then you can't really get to it after that. Yeah. Flying Machine does connect though. Fourteen fifty three bottom left hand tower to fourteen eighteen over on the other game. By the way, Jupiter King versus Faust in the final minute forty five. Jupiter King way ahead. But a nice send here coming in from Faust. Valk will pick up that action. Back over to Morton versus Awesome. And Morton does send the Goblin Barrel to the back onto the Zappy. Skeleton Barrel up front gets some good damage. 14-18 now to 603. That was a ton of damage. Curious about the Inferno Tower choice here from Morton. Pigs get sent to the right hand side. Skarmy in response. Log has been played on defense. So you see the value of the Skarmy here for the German. Jupiter King does win his game against Faust. So nice win there for him. On the left-hand side of your viewership, down to the final 30 seconds, pig split 2-2, two, two, and the pickup in the middle. Fly Machine could be a menace here in the final moments, but that 459, kind of a big gap to make up. Fly Machine does get picked up by the Knight, final 20 seconds. Goblin Barrel goes to the back, picked up by the Log Dark Goblin. Ooh, good East Bird. Going to be held on. Yeah, the Electro Spirit does a good job. Does that going to make enough room for that Fly Machine to sneak through? Plenty of elixir here for Morton, sends the Knight down in a good high inferno tower this should be enough for morton to hold on here gonna be tough though does the fly machine get on tower fly machine does not get on tower and morton wins that one 761 to 387 there we go and yeah, i'm also wondering working. why did he have inferno tower did he already play bomb tower for example um not entirely sure also are you getting that are you, are you getting that weird like sound glitch that i'm getting nope I don't know if the if the chat's hearing it. Rich is an ice school in one trick. Yeah, that's pretty that's pretty accurate. Let's go back to the overall bracket. See if anyone's still playing. And Jack Jack running a pretty fast cycle minor deck. So Morton does win that one over Awesome MK, which is really important. I think he is Awesome the one who beat him in the first round. No, it was Cooper. It was, oh, it was yeah, it was, Cooper. Yeah. Um, yeah. He won the first match against uh, MK by like a couple of HP. Oh yeah, that's right. Guys, here is Sam's uh, YouTube link one more time. If you haven't yet, go ahead and sub subscribe to OP Sam on YouTube because we're going to turn OP Sam into a YouTuber. He's a streamer, but we all want to see him on YouTube. YouTube, YouTube, YouTube. <laughs> um, let's go ahead and see uh, Lapo and Kevin on our main screen. Yeah, that horrible sound glitch. Not yeah, not sure what happened there, guys. Um, so hopefully that sound glitch is fixed now. What is happening to my? Also, Schwartz is playing against Air Server right now. Oh. Huh? Oh my! I might have just lost sound. You know, let me go ahead and reconnect this device. I might have just lost sound on that one here for a second. Go ahead and reconnect that device from scratch. Oh, Schwartz versus Air Surfer right now. Yeah, that's worth watching. Um, says my says it's not charging. Hold on. 
My main iPad is being real funky right now. Where is Air Surfer and Schwartzen? That's a good one. It's looking pretty good for Schwartzen right now. Yep, GG. Oh, already over? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> There's no way uh, Air Surfer is coming back. All right. Let's see. Um, what else we got going on? Uh, Dark Angel versus Jack is what we're watching on the right-hand screen. Let's go ahead and check out um, Bob the Rock versus Anaban. Nope, that's not happening either. Great. Um, let's see. Kevin and Lapo. Spectate. Open. There we go. And Jack and Jack takes out Dark Angel. I believe that was game the the last game there. I could be wrong. Does Sam have a creator code? No, I do not have a creator code yet. Do yes. you have a creator code? Say what? Do you have a creator code? I do have a creator code. Hold on. Let me go ahead and uh, see if I even have the. There you go up at the top right. You're getting code rich, guys. Up there on the top right. Code Rich. Put that in all your Supercell games and uh, support me. There you go. And, yeah, Sam, once you start you know, doing a bunch of, of YouTubing and you blow up your YouTube channel, you'll have a creator card in no time, I guess. That's my theory. Yeah, but don't you need, like, 50k subs to apply for the creator code? Uh, um, that's what I heard. That might be it. I don't know. But you'll get there in no time. I, what are you at on Twitch right now? Uh, 25k? Oh, yeah. Dude, you'll be there in no time between Twitch and YouTube. It'll, you'll be there, like, yesterday. So if you if you start making regular YouTube content, you'll hit that, like, tomorrow, basically. So just go do it. Check out LCOP. Let's see where they are in this game. LCOP currently with the match point. Jupiter and Faust still going. Here we go. Elsie up against Hema. Let's see how many subs Sam has now on his YouTube. Sam has 767. Guys, let's get Sam to 1K. Let's get Sam up to 1K. Go ahead and make it happen. And why do I have no game sound? Why do I have no game sound? The game sound is crapped out on me? That's weird. Hmm. Hold on, folks. I think that because of the... I think that audio glitch was something. Um, hmm. We have lost our game sound temporarily, so I'll put some music on while we're trying to get that sorted. Check boss. Boss is not in this stage of the tournament, guys. In case you were curious. Oh, boy. Uh, Faust running Goblin Giant Sparky. What do you I think of that? Is that he, is that worth? He's known for Sparky. Yeah. He's a Sparky. Like he, he's not using a lot of Sparky. I wouldn't say he's a Sparky one trick, but he's using a lot of Sparky. Who's the all-time best Sparky player in your opinion? Uh, I do not know. I don't want to say Final Final form. <laughs> <laughs> the Maybe Obisum. it's. Agony King, that guy that always uses Spark Tornado. <laughs> yeah, it is. The, 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 it is interesting that like the top Sparky players don't play like classic Sparky decks, but they play like weird out there off meta Sparky. Yeah, decks. for example, what's the, the one guy's name that you that's using G Skelly Sparky with Mirror? With Mirror? That's yeah. happening. Yeah, don't have his name in mind right now. Hmm. Uh, Boss is the best Sparky player, says Edo Chino. Boss is also pretty good with Sparky. He's using it a lot. But I wouldn't say D best. Guys, you hear that music? Get down. That's right. It's all 80s synthwave on this channel, folks. Lightning in. Dark Prince going to get turned around. Here we are in the final minute 10 seconds. And this should be over. It's so hard to defend Graveyard with this, and it's not going to happen. GG, well played. Elsie up takes the diggity dub.
And then Cooper and Aslan. Um, Cooper and the Lion over on uh, the other screen here. Um, some people saying Rami, Rami's the best Sparky player. Who's Rami? I'm not sure. <laughs> Rami Bami. Don't know who that is. Me neither. I also don't follow ladder. I'm following ladder the most I ever have this year. I generally don't follow, like, I generally have never been, like, a big ladder follower. Um, but now that ladder's tied to CRL, I follow ladder a lot more than I used to. Don't know why there's no sound on my iPad, so we'll dance to 80s music the whole time. <laughs> That's right. Oh, let's see. Um, let's see if we can get Kevin and Lapo's third game on here. Doo -doo -doo. Uh, Rami Heart Rage is a ladder player. Okay, so game sounds are back, but it might be a little glitched out. Let's find out. Rock Cycle. Don't know if that's working. By the way, what is this deck from Cooper? What the heck? He doesn't have a win condition, does he? Oh, How what is, is he winning? What is Cooper playing? He doesn't have Wait, a Wait, we weren't even paying attention. Yeah. Like, did he forget a graveyard or something? I don't know. And he won, though. Aslan has to be so annoyed that he just lost to that. <laughs> I mean, he did have great answers against Lockbait, but how did he do damage? All right, so the, the sound is still glitched, as you guys can hear it. Kevin cycling? Oh, yeah, that rage? sound is still really badly glitched. I don't want to leave the game. I'm going to mute the game sound, guys, and put the music back on. Because that sound is still really glitched for some reason. Sorry. Yeah, let me go ahead. What in the world? All the sound What are the standings? Um, let me go ahead and see if we can get an overall. Um, is there an overall standings page for us to see, please? Um, Jasmina says, say hello to Sam. I'm a fan of him and Morton. Hello, Sam from Jasmina. Hello, Jasmina. Jasmina. That'd be Yasmina. You said hello back. Oh, my God. That's so exciting. <laughs> I hate when people cycle rage and, like, you already know they're going to play Sparky. And I hate playing against Sparky. All right. So yeah, Lapo yeah. really holding back on the uh, on the eagle. You just mm -hmm. heard game sound. Let me try to bring game sound back. My game sound was glitched out, so let me see if I can bring it back. Yeah, you can see that you can hear the game sounds really glitched out. I don't know why. I already tried resetting it. I'm gonna try to do this one more time. But you can see the game sound is like really, really glitched out. I'm gonna turn it way down because it's so glitchy, and I don't know why it's glitchy, guys. I'm doing. I'll do my. I'm doing my best. I do my best. But it is super glitched out. Lightning in. 1001 on the left hand side. So obviously Lapo's winning this one, and it does feel like it's a pretty good matchup for him too, Sam. He's not even playing his one condition. <laughs> He's just cycling lightnings. Seems like the right move here though. Obviously it's working out. Yeah. I mean, he could have E-Giant or Golem. Yeah, you guys hear that glitch. I'm going to try to reset the reset this one more time, guys. I don't know why that sound is so glitched out. Check cables in and out like usual. Yeah, just I'll I'll check it out. I, I, re, I tried to reset it a minute ago. But it's very... You can hear the sounds fuzzy. So after this game, I'll try to reset this connection one more time. And there's the there's the crying face emo. Lapo does drop the eagle on there at the end. Kaboom! FLG in the house. Um, ooh, Sluggy with a great question. We need to get Sam's opinion on Jean Claude Van Damme. Sam, your opinion on Jean Claude Van Damme. The, the people want to know. Who is Jean Claude Van Damme? <sighs> Guys, did you hear that? Who is Jean Claude Van Damme? Man. That's emotional. Let me see if I have the picture somewhere around here. 
Um, was it over here? No. Hmm. Let's go ahead and get some more gameplay up. I'm going to go ahead and try to try to reset the sound one more time. And no one's in the game because we are finally going to game number three here, folks. Um, what I don't have anywhere is the overall standings. I'm asking for a, a page that has just the overall standings right now. Um, so hopefully we get that here in a moment. And I can give you the overall standings as they currently are. As you know, as you guys might know, the standings are only um, per round robin, unfortunately. Um, let me go ahead and plug back in. I'll give you the results, the oh, all the results here from the first round robin. I'm trying to find the, if we can get a place with the overall standings. So here's the, oh, that's so funny. You can't see any of the, any of the results because it's it's cropped. Um, all right, let's, I'll just go ahead and do the standings here, the, the round two standings. So there's the round two standings. Um, how do you not know Jean-Claude Van Damme? Um, you better be looking up Jean-Claude Van Damme right now. That's what you should be doing, Sam. If you're not doing that, you're making a big mistake. Okay, I'm looking him up. Yes, thank you. Bloodsport? So he's an actor. Not, I mean, he's the actor, some might say. Jeez. Yeah, I've never seen this guy before. <sighs> These generational differences are getting harder and harder every year, man. <laughs> harder and harder every year. Maybe I'm too young. For that, not sure. Jean Claude Van Damme, the muscles from Brussels. Great way to put it there. Top t top tier explanation explainer of who Jean Claude Van Damme is. All right, here we're going into round number three, and um, we'll, put, we'll put, I think it's Bob and Faust on this one. No, it's Bob and IMJP on the right hand screen. Um, I wish I had the overall standing somewhere. I'm asking League Ops for them. Morton is in game. Moogie's in game. Faust is in game. What are we watching? Um, let's see. I'm trying to find out, um, who's like, I'm trying to get the standings page so I can see the, um, so like see who are the ones that are close matchups to watch. Um, but right now, um, I have Faust, I have JP and Bob the Rock on my, on my second screen and trying to find, um, I don't know what are the close matchups right now. Um, also what happened to... I swear, I swear I just... Oh, there we go. Moogie and Faust. Let's go ahead and throw that one up. Um, I'm, guys, I'm going to get the... I'm going to get the standings. Um, anything helps. All right, I'm asking for the standings right now. Man, why is my... This, this iPad has been having some real issues today, guys. And... That iPad just died on me. Got it. Got it. All right, guys. Well, let me go ahead and plug that in separately. And I'm going to bring my phone back up as our... Let me go ahead and turn off notifications here. And my, my phone will be the second... Uh, will be our second screen here. Because that iPad died on me. All right. Text notifications are off. Let's go ahead and jump back in here. And let me go ahead and get you guys into that matchup. Um, watch Moogie and Rad matchup. They're both three and two. All right, so I'm trying to get to. I'm trying to get there. Where are you, Moogie and Rad? Oh, it's Rad. I see Rad and Jupiter King. Yeah, Moogie's playing against Floss right now. Oh, but they're they're in separate matches. But there we go. I see what you mean. I see what you mean. Okay, so here we go. There we go. And I'm going to go ahead and make this screen a little bit bigger now, guys, because we are going to be sticking on this screen for the remainder of the game. So give me one second as I adjust it. That's too large. And that'll be good. All right. Oh, is that is that going to finish off? Princess going for the shot with the log. GG. GG. Moogie takes Faust. It's also a pretty good group. Moogie and Faust in the same group? It is pretty good. Yeah, that's pretty bad. Pretty bad ace. And, I mean, JP in a whole lot of trouble here. That's a hard defense against uh, against Graveyard, though. 
Do you remember when Van Damme accidentally kicked Cody Garbrandt in the face and thought he was going to get um, – that Cody going to come and get him? I actually don't remember that, but that's really funny. All right, let's go ahead and we'll check out Jupiter. Who, again, Moogie and Jupiter are competing for first place in the group right now. They are not against each other, but they are both in that run, in that race. Has a stream just started? Are you late? Yeah, you're super late, dude. It's basically, this is, we're in the final round. Let's see, let's go ahead and, and check out an update on Sam's YouTube page right now. <laughs> Sam, currently at 785. Guys. We're getting there. We're getting there. Hit Sam, hit Opie Sam with a sub right now on YouTube. Um, and I'm trying to... just won a game. Who just won a game? Airsofer. Okay, okay. I'm trying to get Schwarzen the... Um, is playing Elsiop. I'm trying to get all the uh, the standings up right now, guys. Right, I'll bring Morton up on the second screen, everybody. Uh, where is Morton? Morton's not in a game right now, so I'll bring him up in a minute. I'll put up oh Samuel God. Pesoto on the second screen for now. Oh, my God. GG. Swarton just came back with Sparky Rage. Whoa, that'll do it. Yeah, guys, I mean, you could subscribe to me, which is nice, but more importantly, subscribe to OP Sam. That's way more important. Graveyard in here for Rad. Jupiter King does not want to want to lose this. Since you're an MMA guy, what's your prediction on the Askren Paul fight? Um, I I don't know I don't know where Ben Askren's boxing really is because we we saw him do so little of it as an MMA, MMA fighter. I have to imagine that it's better than 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 Logan Paul's though. I have to imagine it's better. I really hope that that, that Askren like puts him down, but we'll see. We'll find out. Maybe Askren is just a wrestling one trick for real and never had any boxing at all. Really don't know. Here we go. Higher putting the hurt now taking the lead back from Samuel, and I'm working to get the uh, standings here, guys, best I can. So as soon as I have standings. I will let you guys know what they are. Ooh. Catching the miner. I think Soda won now. So they're working on getting standings in. Um, let's see. Rocket miner. Rocket miner. So there are no standings in yet. I'll keep GG. an eye on it. All right, GG. Wait, how many rounds are left? This is the last Which round. round are we? This is the last this is round. The last round? Yep. Okay. yep, this is it. But our... A few first places already decided. I'm, I'm about to get as much information on that as I can right now. Here we go. Morton's in game. So we'll send Morton on the second screen here. And we're going to get Moogie on the first screen. Let's see. I don't have I don't have my friends list on my on my um, on my on my mini, unfortunately. So I need to do it through the through this. But then we also get to see the, see the everything that's going on here. Um, let's see, where is that Moogie Faust? Moogie Faust game three. This is going to be huge. Moogie Faust game three. Big, big, big. Okay, so here's the story right now. In group A, and again, I don't know who that leader is. That leader is um, is T or whatever his name was. The guy, the, the guy we didn't know. Um, uh, hold on, let me actually look up, look up his name again. Now that he's going to be on the broadcast probably. Um, hold on. One second, folks. Man, my, my computer is not liking all the things that I'm doing at once. Um, but I'll give you guys the, the general look here of what's going on. Man, my computer is slow right now. Let's see. Um, so the leader in Group A, I believe that would be Ta. Ta is the leader in Group A at 5-0. and o. He's probably already won Group A. We'll see if that holds true. In Group B... Moogie went 3-0 in the first round, but is 0-2 so far in the second round. So this, this BO3 here is going to decide a lot. And, of course, Jupiter King is also tied up at 3-2. Um, Rad um, could go 3-2. So, basically, Group B is insanity, and we have no idea what's going to happen. Um, let's go ahead and jump in to this matchup, Moogie and Faust. This one is huge. I don't know if Faust... I don't know if mathematically Faust can make everybody 3-3. Three and three. We will find out. Um, in Group C, Morton is currently 5-1. and one. So a win here, I believe, would lock up the group. I don't know if he's already locked up the group, but I believe a win here would lock it up. Oh, wait a second. What? All right. 
Morton. I think Morton should be qualified. Yeah, cause... Morton. I believe Morton just qualified. Yeah. Uh, five and one finish, so that should be good for Morton enough to get through in Group C, and that means Oslan, uh, Awesome, and Cooper are all out. Let's go ahead and put up Jack on this one, it's aka Air Surfer. Um, let's see. In Group D, Sandbox went three and zero in the first round, but is so far one and one in the second round. So we'll see if Sandbox um, can make it five and one or ends up four and one. Um, Belly is leading the second second round robin, but not doing quite enough with it. I think Sandbox is probably going to be the qualifier out of Group D. Um, I'm trying to do. I'm trying to quickly figure out if anybody can can catch up to him. I don't think anyone can catch up to Sandbox because he has. I don't think anyone else can reach four wins now. Um, yeah, no one else can reach four wins. So I think Sandbox already qualified out of Group D. In Group E, Samuel is 5-0. and Everyone else is just playing Samuel's game. Um, nice. In Group F, uh, let's see. Air, Sur Air Surfer's lost both of his games in, in, in the second round robin. Um, Schwarzen is 4-1. and Elsiop is 4-1. and um, Air Surfer is 2-3. And, three, and uh, Hema is out. So it's down to Schwarzen versus Elsiop to lead to win Group F. So we'll see who comes out on top of this one. So this Air Surfer matchup, unfortunately, isn't actually competitively relevant here. Um, let's see if I can pick up uh, Schwarzen's matchup. I think this is a really good matchup for movie here. Oh, this is actually—I think this is a this is a playoff match. So it's Schwarzen and Elsiop. So Schwarzen is at four and one. Elsiop is also at four and one. So the winner of this wins the group. So this is huge. So we'll be following Schwartz and, and, and Elsiop. Um, let's see. I th Lapo's at 5-1 and one right now. Dark Angel won the first round robin 3-0, and oh, but then went 0-2. Oh so I believe that Lapo has locked up Group G. More on that later. And then in Group H. Group H kind of seems all over the place. Um, but I think Bob the Rock probably has Group H. Bob the Rock is 4-1. and one. Anaban is three and two. So if Bob loses this game, that opens the door up. But the question is, does Bob lose this, lose this match or not? That'll be the big question for everybody. So we will keep an eye on all of that. Moogie and Faust, though, important. Ta, yeah, it's Ta. All right. Um, are you um, watching Moogie and Faust, or which, which match are you yeah. watching right now? Faust is playing really, really good right now. I don't even know how he's defending. <laughs> Like, Moogie has arrow zap against Spear Gobs, Dark Goblin. And he might be done defending, though. Oof. Does that second bomb drop? That's the big question. Arrows comes out just in time. I think he didn't need the arrows. I don't know. You can't, you can't really risk that second bomb, though, right? Yeah. I mean, in that situation, I would have probably thrown him as well. Minor on the arrows tower. Arrows to Dark Goblin and GG, isn't it? Do those spears yeah. stop the balloon? Oh, that's it. That's it. Fish Boy comes in. Moogie! Foss made it close, but not quite here. Does Schwarzen have to win this and he's qualified? Or? Um, it's Yeah, this is Schwarzen versus Elsiop is like the winner goes through. Okay. So I don't know if this is game, what, what game this is. If this is game, um, like game one, two, or three in this matchup. It's so funny. I keep on I keep on getting notifications. You saw someone get a notification on my phone. I made a video about how to activate King Tower versus Mortar. Um, and somebody, every once in a while, someone, like, every week or so, someone comments with the, about the video about how it's useless because Mortar shoots you from across the bridge, so who cares? And then I have to, I have to have a, a comment that I copy-paste, like, Mortar Miner, Mortar Hog, Mortar Graveyard. <laughs> but someone always has to feel like they're smart and go, how is this useful against Mortar? <laughs> I don't know, Mortar GY is, like, central meta? I mean, there's that one deck that doesn't use Hog graveyard or whatsoever just rocket cycle but no one's nobody's using that. that yeah no, yeah, one's, no using one's using that, that. so funny um all right let's bring up let's see let's, let's take a look at these results here um moogie won the match against faust so now it comes down to um what jupiter king is doing from a tiebreaker perspective and i don't know how, like i don't know what their records are from the tiebreakers so we'll keep an eye on this um we're gonna go ahead and bring up rad versus jupiter king because Jupiter, oh, that's match is complete. Oh, all right, Moogie's through. Jupiter lost, so Moogie goes through. There you go. 
Um, Moogie's out. Ooh. Or Moogie's in. Jupiter King's out. Um, let's see. Sandbox, I think, I think already Sharks clinched. Sharks winning this. I think... Did Elsie up win the... Elsie up won the first one, though, right? Against Schwarzen? Yeah, so this is, this is about to be... Let me see yeah. what the score is between Elsie up and Schwarzen. Don't see the de greater damage coming through. I think that this is game two on this one. Um, I think Samuel already clinched. I'm trying to see which ones are... Are, let's just go ahead and put Samuel in higher up. Yeah, Schwarzen won. One zero Schwarzen standing. So it's now one zero, or is it two zero now? Go watch Lapo. Okay, let's go ahead and watch Lapo. Um, all right, let's bring up Lapo. Where is Lapo? Lapo, 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 Lapo. Where are you, Lapo? Um. Oh, there we go. Oh no, Dark Angel already won. Oh, this. Oh, this was. Oh, I'm looking at match five. Like an idiot. Like an idiot. All right, here we go. This is... Why is it showing me match five again? Second half. Go to match... Why is it showing me... I, I'm pre you guys can see I'm pressing match six here. I don't know why it's showing me match five over and over again. Um, let's go ahead and put up belly here for the moment. I don't know why it's still giving me match six, even though I'm, cr I'm pressing match five. All right, here we go. Hitting round three. So I can see match six. It's still showing me match five for some reason. That's so weird. All right. Um, uh, Bob versus JP. All of these games are just being locked down here. I'm trying to watch Lapo, guys, but I think Lapo's already. I think Lapo already lost. The bracket link is in the chat. Is in the description, guys. If you guys want the bracket link. Um. Let's see. Trying to watch any of these. Let me go maybe reload the page, see if that works. Yeah, I'll bring up Samuel right here. What was that sound? That was a <laughs> ring notification for my door in Los Angeles, actually. Um, so there's Hire and Samuel. All right, this game's on. The finals for March are next are next week, guys, so definitely make sure you go there. All right, here you go. Guys, I'm putting OP Sam's link in the chat one more time. Sub to OP Sam. Sub to OP Sam. He's OP, so sub to him. Let's see what he's at now. He better be over 800 subs. If he's not over 800 subs, I have to fight everybody. Like, you know, it's actually we're at the end. We're in the final. I have to put on the final game, Sonny's. The professional respawners. Boom. Here we go. 792. Guys, we're eight away from putting him at 800. Eight subs away. Please go. The, the link's in the chat. Go subscribe to OP Sam. If you don't, it's probably because, um, I don't know, you hate kit, you hate puppies or whatever. That's my guess. Let's see. Um, JP and Bob. Can we get that game going? No, we can't. The official stream of not watching games. Um, Schwarzen and, and LCOP already ended, didn't it? I'm so confused. Ooh. Oh, here we go. There, here Lord we go. Lost. Let's go. Okay, now open. Now now open. Why are you not I think open? Hire's winning this. I think so, too. All right, so I guess that game Good. is done because that's taking me to nothing. It's two hits from the mortar. Yep. Ah, okay. I think. It's, ah, mm. Oh, oh, oh. I think Samuel is getting the tower. It's enough time, isn't it? Ten 13, seconds. Thirteen seconds. Does that should electro be, giant? Be Ooh, that's, that's a big old lightning. Will Samuel get there? <laughs> will Samuel get there? And he will get there. We're going to sudden death overtime. And I do not understand what's happening with anything. Um, for some reason, the uh, Schwarzen versus Elsiot match is all locked up. So, more on that later. Let's see if maybe we can find Beacon Booyah. Here we go. <clears throat> Honestly, I think Pesoto is winning this now. He can just spam troops on the left. Higher can't really go for the free crown. Spam those troops, bro. 
Hi has no big spell. And hey, Sam is over 800 subs. Let's go. 802. Let's go. Dude, we jumped to like 130 subs today. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you, guys. About to be it's the biggest kind of German broken. YouTuber. It's kind of broken that Arrows just one hit the bomber. Yeah, but it's a, but it's a negative one trade, right? Because it's bombers two. So Arrows one hitting bomber makes is actually like kind of makes sense, doesn't it? Yeah, I guess. Like, sure, you you wipe it off, but like, also like, negative. You one. get so much more value. You hit the baby dragon, the dark prince, everything. Yeah. And all that in the pocket here. Hmm. Pretty close. Higher is no miners, so it's gonna be hard for him to get any damage on the tower. David Marquez asking. The Soto can just put a lightning. Um, mm. David Marks or Marquez asking, why should we subscribe to OP Sam sell it? Well, let me give you some great reasons. Number one, OP Sam, just from a competitive standpoint, um, CRL NA third place, CRL Western champion, um, World Cyber Games champion. Number two, he's a German with excellent English. Which, you know, you just got to give someone some love for... Is that your only two languages, Sam, or do you know more languages than that? How many languages do you speak? No, I, speak I only speak English and German. I mean, I can speak a little bit French, a little bit Spanish, but pretty bad. So I he's... also had French in school for three years, but my French is horrendous. So Sam speaks... Let's, <laughs> let's combine those three into, like, one half. Sam speaks two and a half languages. Kind of five-ish, but really two and a half languages. That's a reason to subscribe to Sam. Number three, excellent hair and glasses. No one else has hair and glasses that work together like that. So um, another great reason. Um, I need to go ahead and figure out who's at my house right now. I'm going to have to pop off here and look at those notifications in a moment and see who the heck is at my house in Los Angeles. Um, hog in. Other reasons to subscribe to Sam. Um, one of the greatest 2v2 duos of, on, of all time. Um, excellent dancer from what I've seen. Uh, snazzy dresser. From what you've seen. <laughs> Where have I danced? Um, I've seen you dance once or twice. Here we go. Tower down, left-hand side. I need to figure out who the heck is at my house. With these alerts that I'm getting. All right, let's see if we can get some standings here, if they're updating them ever. I want to know the standings, folks. I want to know the standings. Let's go back in here and see what we can get from who's playing. Number five, he's my friend. That's actually a great, a good enough reason. He's my friend. Um, number six, excellent Clash Royale player. It's kind of the same as number one, but not really. Number seven, good sense of humor. Um, am I doing your dating profile right now? Number eight, financially stable. <laughs> number nine, treats kids really well. Sub to Sam. There you go. There's his, There's a YouTube link. Maybe he'll do some some English content if you guys sub to him. Oh, Rad is just like playing a random game. I just have. I think we're all. I think the games are all done here. Are they? And they're saying Schwartz in two zero over Elsiop. I want to see the standings. Yeah, me too. I'm trying to see if we get some standings here. I mean, I can check Twitter. People probably tweeted something already. Yeah, let's see. All right, I'm gonna do some. I'm gonna do some unofficial standings right now, folks. Unofficial. Nothing confirmed yet. Unofficial. Um, Ta wins Group A with a record of. Shouldn't he have a sixth game? What is going on? Why is does Soto is, this... is in it? Morton is in. Foss is out. Um. Yeah. Moogie. Moogie. I think Moogie wins his group. Moogie ends up. Wait. Why does it have Moogie as a lo as one and two in this group? Didn't Moogie go two and one in this group? I'm very confused. I thought Moogie went two and one. Let me go see if I can bring that up. Dark Angel is actually in the next round. He's 4 and 2, so is Lapo, but he has tiebreaker over him. Oh, wow. Um, hold on. Brackets, let's go to, let's go to part 2. Let's go to standings in part 2. I really th I thought Mugi. What happened there? Didn't Mugi win his. Didn't I thought Mugi won his match? I thought Mugi won his match. Won, won that. Did I just like. Did my brain just break? Samuel tweeted top nine in CRL. That's hilarious. Um, hold on. We're trying to figure this out. Yeah, Schwarzen also made it. 
Yeah, well, Schwartz with the, with the win over Elsiop, that should mean he made it. Just we're trying to get these unofficial final standings, folks. There should be some some cool synthwave music coming coming your way here in a moment, so that we have something going on. My computer is just not liking anything today. Um, waiting on these standings because I'm not going to say anything until I get like the I have like a, a standings page from from the official league ops that I'm looking at. I am I am so confused. I thought that Moogie won that last game. Did I, did I like did my brain stop working? Oh, so Rad just finishes remember. and just keeps on playing. Um, let's go ahead and put belly. Let's go ahead and put some belly gameplay on. Um, let's go to let's go to game three here. Yeah, Moogie beat Faust. Was that his only? That wasn't his only win in this round, was it? Moogie lost to Rad and lost to Jupiter. Okay, so he did beat Faust. These are some complicated standings here, folks. So it does appear that Ta won Group A. Group B, Moogie went four and two. Rad went four and two. Jupiter King went one and two. And Faust went two and three. So it's between Moogie and Rad to see who wins Group B. So not sure on that. Is, Saint, is Belly really playing touchdown right now? That's so funny. <laughs> That's so funny. Belly's playing touchdown right now. Um, Morton went five and one and very clearly won his group. Congrats to Morton moving on. Sandbox went five and one and very handily won his group. So congrats to Sandbox. Try to be happy with that pickup for this season. Um, Samuel went, if this says 5-0, and oh, it should say there should be a sixth game there. Um, but Samuel won his group, no problem. Um, it's not, I haven't even updated these things yet. Uh, but Schwarzen, I believe, has qualified in his group. Uh, Dark Angel at 4-2 and two, and Lapo at 4-2. and two, But you said that Dark Angel has the tiebreaker there? Yeah. Do you know what? You know he do you know how he has the tiebreaker? Because he won both games against them. Oh well, there you go, Dark. GG's for for Queso. And then Bob the Rock went. Did Bob did Bob play his last game yet? I think he did. Not sure. So going into the so I see that Anna Ban was four and two, and if Bob lost, he would be four and two as well. So what I don't know is if Bob won or lost that last game. Let me go see what. Let me go see if I can figure out what Bob won or lost that last game. Um, let's go. Where is Carl de Groot? And Bob lost it. So Anaban might be through to the top eight. Waiting to confirm results here, folks. Waiting to confirm results. I'm going to reach out to League Ops here in a second, and then I'm going to turn to chat here. Um. I'm waiting for an update from League Ops. Um, so there's an Anaban Bob tie and a Moogie Rad tie. We're just trying to figure out what those tie, how those tiebreakers work. Let me look at the chat here for a second. Um, this is awesome gameplay. Oh yeah, this this uh, this is pretty fun. Link to bracket, please. The link is in the um, the Twitch link, guys. That's not the correct link. The link is in the YouTube bracket, the YouTube description, where you say where you see bracket. So we're trying to figure out, um, figure out who's what, guys. If you haven't yet subbed to my channel, but more importantly, <laughs> if you haven't yet subbed to Sam's channel and make him do both English and German, right? Your uh, your friend and teammate Morton has like almost 100k subs on both an English and German YouTube page. That's pretty cool. And I bet you could do. I bet you could. I bet that if you started doing YouTube like legit, like hardcore. That you could have like twenty or thirty k on each page within three months, three or four months. Might take you six months, but either way, I think you do it pretty easily. Can I just become a Clash Quest YouTuber? Did you play the game yet? I have played Clash Quest. So, what's your opinion? Potential, is my opinion. There's potential. Um. Let's see. They are working on the tiebreakers right now between Rad and Moogie, Lapo and Dark Angel, and Bob and Anaban. That's what that's what admin says. Sub to Sam says Nikhil. Yep. Um, Dimer saying who's the winner in the group, Lapo or Dark? 
Um, Dark Angel is claiming victory because he won both games against Lapo. So that should, I believe that's the case, but we're still waiting on official confirmation. So they are working behind the scenes to get the official standings page updated. And once we have that, I will give you the information. Um, in the meantime, let's see who else is playing. Um, is Belly still playing some touchdown? Yep, let's play some, let's play some hot touchdown over here. Who is at my front, guys? I'm gonna I'm gonna close this for a second. See who's at my who's at my house in Los Angeles because I'm getting all these notifications. I gotta find out who's going in and out of my home. Oh, okay, I know you. Dope. That's fine. You're supposed to be there. Got it. All right, I'll bring this back up again. So let me go ahead and put the the second part leaderboards on here. There's your standings. Yes, I know that flame blaziken, but it only gives you standings for each for each of the two group rounds, right? So we don't we only have. We, I know what all the actual um, like gameplay. You know what? Maybe I can go ahead and do this really quick. Let me go here. Oh, that's all messed up. One second, folks. I'm gonna come. I'm gonna come back here. But let me go ahead and do like a. Um, nope, nope. I don't want that. Let me go ahead and do some studio mode here. Let's go to here. And um, hmm. let me go ahead and do a uh, one second, folks. Let me do a uh, let's call it a browser source. Let's do that. Let's do that. And then we'll go ahead and grab this. Here is an unofficial bit of standings here, folks. Oh, that's is not appreciating that. Okay, got it. Um, then let me do this. Let me go ahead and take out, get rid of that browser source. I'm gonna remove that browser source, folks. We're gonna do a little bit of window capture here. Little windy capture. Um, let me go ahead and grab this window. Where are you? Where are you? Um, this should be it. All right, so this is the, as I'm working on it, the standings and tiebreakers. We're trying to figure out the actual tiebreakers right now. Let me go ahead and throw this in here. Boom, there's the current standings and tiebreakers. We're trying to figure it out right now, but this is what I'm looking at. So you can see all the different um, like results and stuff here, but we have not gotten any official standings put in yet, so they are working to plug those in. So as soon as I have that information, guys, I will hit you guys up with those official standings. Um, what would happen if two players are four and two and one of them won against the other one? And then it goes to our next tiebreaker, which I might be game win rate, not entirely sure. Um, let's see, other than picking Sam because he's on call, one BO5 to save your life, which CR player do you put in? Oh, that's a good question. One BO5 to save my life. Who do I put in? <laughs> hmm. One BO5 to save my life. Who do I go with? I, you know what? At this point, maybe I have to go with Line. He's been in, in BO5, in, in BO3, BO5 style tournaments. Line's been pretty gangster. I might have to go with Line. Also, he's he, he, he I don't think he would feel any pressure because Line and I don't know each other. So he wouldn't be like, I feel the pressure of saving Rich's life. He'd be like, I'm playing a BO5. And if I win, this guy lives. And if he loses, he dies. But I don't know him, so who cares? Right? So I think Line's a good choice. I don't know. What do you think, Sam? If you won BO5 to save your life and it can't be yourself, who do you pick? Do you pick Morton because he's your friend or do you pick or do you not pick him because you think it would be like too much pressure because he cares about you so much? Yeah, I would pick him. I would pick him. Oh, boy. Because he knows me and then he would try hard to save me. He would. Oh, so like, oh, yeah, no, you can't pick. You can't, like, you, I definitely wouldn't pick someone like Igor because Igor might troll during like my save my life game. You know what I mean? Like, you got to pick <laughs> someone who's going to try. That's for sure. And if I yeah, um, Ruben's a good, a good is certainly a good choice, but I think Line's a great call. I think Line's a great call because I think Line is uh, Line's a great Bo5 player specifically. Yeah, I just wouldn't. I, I don't know. You, so you pick you pick Morton. I under, I understand that. How do you not How do you not pick Morton? But I feel like I'd have to pick someone who uh, doesn't care as much, but who would just play dispassionately, who would play well and play hard, but play dispassionately and not feel the pressure, right? That's how I'd go with it. Um, Strostar saying, I just got here as Morton doing well. 
Um, unofficially, Morton has qualified. We're going to wait for official results here in a minute. But unofficially, Morton has qualified through. So I'm just refreshing the standings page, trying to get the final final results here. I'll give you guys some of this. is the standings from, um, from the second half of our round robins. I mean, I'm just really here for the touchdown content, to be honest. Against Thunderstruck. <laughs> touchdown is a great game. Dude. I like touchdown. It's pretty fun. Yeah. No, a touchdown, a touchdown underrated. Touchdown underrated for sure. Uh-oh, but look at that. Ram Rider picked up by the cannon. You know what? I'm going to... Are you watching... Do you have do you have a belly on your... Belly or Thunderstruck on your list? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> touchdown Thunderstruck. <laughs> belly in a lot of trouble here. They should ban a couple of cards like Hog Rider, Ram Rider, Royal Hawks. They're all so broken in this. Oh, like touch touchdown touchdown bans, dude. Maybe I should yes. do a touchdown uh, a touchdown. They tournament. actually they actually they actually removed Hog Rider, Ram Rider, and so on from the from touchdown, but uh, they brought it back in. I don't know why. Skelly Bear are gonna go over and Belly ties things up. I believe that's all tied. No, Belly's down one, two to one, lead right now for Thunderstruck in this touchdown battle as we are waiting for our final CRL April qualifier results. Ram Rider and Balloon. Look at the split lane pressure here. Ram Rider going to go to the cannon. But what does Belly have for this Balloon? Going to try to block here with the uh, Skeleton Rider. Barrel, but Ram Rider should go through. EQ to slow down, and Thunderstruck takes the touchdown. GG, well played. The Scotsman is once again the greatest player in Britain. Can we have the results, please? I agree. Mugi beat Raz, so uh, Rad, so Mugi qualifies as Flame. That's Flame's theory. That's Flame's theory. I'm waiting to get the final results here, the officials. And so far, still no of no official results in. So we're gonna kick it until the official. Oh, 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 I get official was. Hey, do you wanna? Do you wanna? Uh, you want to try playing some some rando decks while we're waiting here? Yeah, we can play touchdown, for sure. Ooh, yeah, throw some, play some touchdown, bro. <laughs> touchdown, not? touchdown needs a world final, dude. I would do it. There's someone at my front door. Yeah, I know who's there. I sh I could turn off my ring notifications, um, but I actually turned them back on recently because again, I'm I'm in Texas. I'm not there, and ring helps me keep my home secure. Um, let's see. Let's go. Let's let's do. Our, let's check in on Sam's uh, on Sam's subs on YouTube. See where you guys are on the YouTube subs. Sam is currently at eight hundred nine YouTube subscribers. You know, maybe if we're lucky, we'll take it'll it'll take so long to get the results that we'll be able to get you to a thousand on this stream. Mm. How how long does it usually take to get the results? Um, I don't know. It's only the third one we've done. I don't think I I didn't stream the first one so. Um, hopefully we get this in soon. Let's see. Air Surfer I mean, has The players zero. already know if they're qualified or not. Um, the players say they know. Rich, why do you <laughs> like the Ice Golem so much? Because it's the best card in the game, bar none. Every other card is trash. Ice Golem is king. Easy, easy answer there. Jeez. Sam, um, what's the best card in the game and why is it Ice Golem? What? <laughs> why is it Ice Golem? What? So there's, it's there's uh, th terrible. You say Ice Golem's terrible? <laughs> yeah. It's like washed. No one's using it anymore. Only Expo players. I'm speechless here. I'm, <laughs> you know, I thought we were friends, but now that I see your views on Ice Golem, I just don't even know if, um, if I can maintain. Oh, so oh, you oh you want to play me in touchdown? Oh my gosh, I don't even know what deck I have. We're going in. Oh, here we go. Here we go. We're gonna play. Some, oh, we're gonna play some touchdown. Ooh, I think I go. I think I go with that. Um, that's not gonna help me, is it? Is that gonna help me here? Um, ooh man, I actually don't know what the best choice is. I need to have a. If I don't have a spell, it's game over. Um, oh my god. Uh, yeah. That's gotta be better, right? That's gonna be better than uh, than that. Oh boy. Guys, we're playing touchdown. While we're waiting for these for these results, we're gonna play some touchdown. This is gonna Let's be fascinating. Go. Kill the goblin ASAP. Uh, I don't have a spell. Oh my god, help! <laughs> okay, okay, I think I can. Come on, can I? Can I do this? Get out of my way! Get out of my face! Get out of my face! Get out of here! 
Mm. Get out of here. Oh my god, we're playing such a spammy race right now. Oh my. Oh my. Help! Help! No! Oh, come on! <laughs> Let's freaking go! Guys, one up. Oh good, I'm coming back. I don't even believe you. Boom. <laughs> Help! We're pl I'm I'm playing touchdown. Oh, let's see, an expo. Thanks. You ch you uh, chose I expo in touchdown this. mode. I don't think I can defend this. <laughs> I do not think I'm defending. <laughs> I mean, you gotta play something to defend it. I mean, just... that's all I have. Oh, you know, what? I'm gonna do that then. <laughs> the little BM poison in the middle of the in the middle of the map. Let's go. Nice. Let's I'm go. Moving. We're waiting on final standings, guys. That's why. The reason we're playing touchdowns is because we're waiting on the final standings, and final standings are not in yet. And you know hmm. what? I'm going to do a little swerve on Sam. Look at this. I, got, I went right for the first to open the first two games. Going left this time. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. You know what? What do I... Eh, you know what? Let's put some pressure. Let's put some pressure here, folks. Nice. Now we're going to do this. Protect that princess. Protect Help. that princess. Protect that princess. 3-0. <laughs> Let's go. Knockout blow. You heard it here first. Rich Slayton. OP now. It's now. it's OP Rich now, guys. What's up? What's up? XOPX Rich. Rematch. Let's go. Guys, I am waiting for these official results. <laughs> And in nice. the meantime, I'm just gonna keep on clapping this uh, this supposed pro player in touchdown. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, you want more of this? I want a revenge. I think this is a better choice. Ooh, that's. Ooh, I'm winning. I already know. Oh, you are. Okay. Yep. Okay. 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 I'm gonna play one card. You're not gonna be able to defend it, and one, I'm winning. One card that I can't. Def one card and I can't defend it. Yeah. Um. I have it in cycle. No, I don't. Okay. Um. I'm going to play this. Probably a bad call. Guys, we're waiting on C. We're waiting on the CRL scores, guys. We're waiting on the final scores. Oh, this is this is actually this 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 is a talk about bad. Oh no! Oh no! That's the <laughs> card. That's the card. I know it. No, that's not the card. That's not the card. Nope. That's not the card that I can't defend. Oh my lord! Nope. What else do you have? It's coming in right now. No! <laughs> no! I also can't defend the eagle. -um. No! And the eagle -um scores. Get out of here. Brohawks are so broken in this. They are so broken in this game. Oh my word. Oh my word. All right. Well, we're gonna we're gonna do that. Good luck defending that now. It's all good. Where are these standings, please? Tiebreakers are done. Okay. Can we get the final? We're gonna finish this game, and hopefully by then we have the official standings. Um. Oh, I, I don't think I can even stop those. I can't stop any of this. I can't stop. Oh, there we go. Some spears to help out. It's to pull. Oh my god, I don't I don't have it. I don't have it in cycle. And it's gonna be a blob anyway. Eagle is gross. Let's go. Um, <laughs> um posting in doc. Guys, we should be getting the 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 final standings here in a moment. They said that they've finished the tiebreakers. So hopefully we have the tiebreakers in here in a second and we can actually see the official results in just a moment. Officially, I am getting clapped all the way. Oh, why would you do? It's it's in the dock. I don't see it in the dock. Um. 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 Hold on. Um. Um. I can't stop them. I can't stop them. <laughs> I can't stop any of this. I can't stop any of this. It's impossible. Um, you. Let's go. So um, 3, -0, 3 0 it's basically drawn. It's basically a draw. You know what? We just got, we decided that we are even. Um, guys, so, we so. have... I can't, for some reason, the standings sheet isn't updating with them. Um, but I can grab this graphic here. I'm going to open... I'm going to grab a graphic and i um, going to put it on... Uh, put it on screen here. And we will have our finals. You have to refresh it. Yeah, I, well, I did refresh it. Maybe I have to like close it and open it again. Let me see. Let me see if that works. 
If I close and open again, then I'll, then I'll give it to you. Come on. Mm, nope. All right. Well, I have a, a thing. A thing. Let's go take a look at it. I'm going to make this really big. There are your final qualifiers, guys. I know it's really small. I'm sorry. It's annoyingly small. Let me make it really big, as big as I can. There you go. Here are your final qualifiers. Top eight advancing. Rat uh, and that's Morton. not still not working. Okay, here we go. Top eight advancing. So Ta Rad over Moogie. Oh wow, Rad over Moogie. Crazy. Morton Sandbox. Same episode. Schwarzen, Dark Angel, and Bob the Rock. That's your. That's the the the, the, the players advancing. Unbelievable. I know everyone besides the first one. Yeah, I don't think any, I don't know I don't know him either. Um, his group was Ali. I mean, that was probably the sm the 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 least like OP group, right? Ali is good. Yusuf is good. Chris Tarda is. I don't know Chris Tarda, but like there were no big time names in that group. So Ta comes out on top here. Um, I cannot believe that Rad that Rad overtook Moogie. Man, that's so crazy. It felt like it was, it was going to be Jupiter King and Moogie the whole time. Morton wins his group. Sandbox won his group pretty handily. Um, Samuel obviously kind of crushed his group. Schwarzen and Elsiop came down to the final. Dark Angel over Lapo, And, you know, you lose both games, and there you go. But then Bob the Rock going 5-1 and one and winning his group. So there you go. There are the final, the final qualifiers. GG, well played. Man, not making Moogie not making it. That is, I'm Moogie, very. Moogie just tweeted a clown emoji on Twitter. <laughs> okay. He might be mad. He might be a little bit annoyed, but you know, them's the breaks, folks. That's how uh, that's how this game works. I don't know if you guys know it, but it's called Clash Royale, and sometimes it goes your way, sometimes it doesn't go your way. Um, guys, that's gonna be that's gonna be it for us. Let's do our final. Let me go ahead and come back on screen. I don't have. I wish I had my. Um, oh, I'm, there's me. Oh, I'm, I'm all big now. Uh, let's see. There's the gameplay screen. There's the double. Um, guys, my caster today has been OP Sam. I'm Rich Slayton. You can follow me at Rich Slayton. You can follow Sam. Is it just at XOPX Sam on Twitter? Uh, XOPX Sam underscore. Underscore. There's another yeah. XOPX Sam besides you? Yeah, I actually was called XOPX Sam, but then I had to call myself TSM XOPX Sam. And then after I did that, somebody ch stole my name on Twitter. And after I changed it back, like, it was gone. Someone stole your name. Oh, that frame rate is terrible what is going on um someone stole your name on twitter um whoever stole their name uh stole his name you're you're awful and um i dislike you strongly but more importantly sam let's do our final sam at 812 subs here we go one more time there you go sub to sam if you haven't yet subscribed to me as well um i'm gonna close the youtube stream here in a minute and then on twitch we'll go find someone cool to host uh, dude, Sam, so much fun hanging out with you. Thanks for coming on. This was this was really fun. Hi, hey, thanks for having me. Sweet. I mean, anytime, and I can't wait to see all the great YouTube content you're gonna put out soon. Now that we're pump, now that we're pumping all up right. your YouTube. Do you have any idea for a YouTube video? Um, yeah, you play Clash Royale and then talk about it to people. Okay. You're a pro player. People will watch you talk about your thoughts about your games. That's my theory. Okay. I don't know. Yeah, I, I also know you happen to have a very successful friend who does YouTube in both German and English, who maybe can give you some <laughs> tips on what to do. Maybe. Maybe might be able to help you out. Um, guys, it's been fun. Uh, YouTube. I'll see you on the official Clash Royale League YouTube page to, uh, next weekend, Saturday and Sunday, for those top eight. Here's one more look at that top eight again. It's going to be Ta, Rad, Morton, Sandbox, Samuel Basoto, Schwarzen, Dark Angel, and Bob the Rock. So Morton repeating back-to-back -back weekend, uh, back-to-back -back months, as well as Samuel Basoto. Other than that, a lot of newcomers here to the top eight. Going to be a whole lot of fun. Um, so thanks YouTube for hanging out. Uh, keep on cut I, my butt. I need my buttons back, guys. It's been fun. I'm Rich Slayton. Uh, later, YouTube, I will see you guys in uh, in a little while. And Twitch, hang on there for a moment. We're going to find someone really cool to go and throw a, a host at. So that'll be fun. I just I, I didn't realize my YouTube stream has um, a delay on again. So, all right, this, this is me waving at YouTube. Bye-bye. 
so that I can kill. I know bye when bye, you guys. kill the YouTube stream. Yeah, bye bye, Sam. What do you, do you want them to sub to you on YouTube or follow you on Twitch or what? Yeah, follow me everywhere. Thank you. Follow Sam everywhere, and I'm waving right now so I can look at the YouTube delay, which I thought there was no delay on. I guess there's a delay on, and I will see you guys later. There's the first wave. Here comes the second, because I want to give Sam his time to play his thing. And Goodbye. and there's a second wave. All right, bye bye YouTube. Boom, YouTube stream ended. Great. Let me.